prophet Nana Poku number one. If you can see, I'm coming to Namibia and I'm coming to shake Namibia very serious. Four days, powerful miracle manifestation. Beloved one, uh, I, I'm coming there on 31st. 31st, from 5 o'clock, the church has started in the, in the evening. 5 o'clock, the church has started. But on the 5th, is Friday. It's all night. Beloved, Saturday, my God, is a service. We will start 5 o'clock the same evening. And let me tell you, Sunday is anointing service. The church will start 8 o'clock. Then I close 3 o'clock. Beloved, let me tell you something. When you are coming to the all night, which is Friday, night, don't forget, come with how much? $200 of uh, Namibian currency, yes, or 200 rands. But let me tell you something. I'll give you a certain miracle soup. You are going to bath. God is going to take every problem out. And I know this program, God is going to use me. Serious. So when you miss this program, you miss your blessing. Meet Nanapoku. Your life will never be the same. I love you too much. We shall meet there. Bye bye. God bless you. God bless you. My name is Prophet Nanapoku number one. If you can see, I'm coming to Namibia and I'm coming to shake Namibia very serious. Four days, powerful miracle manifestation. Beloved one, uh, I, I'm coming there on 31st. 31st, from 5 o'clock, the church has started in the, in the evening. 5 o'clock, the church has started. But on the 5th, it's Friday, it's all night. Beloved, Saturday, my God, is a service. We will start 5 o'clock the same evening. And let me tell you, Sunday is anointing service. The church will start 8 o'clock. Then I close 3 o'clock. Beloved, let me tell you something. When you are coming to the all night, which is Friday, night, don't forget, come with how much? $200 of uh, Namibian currency, yes, or 200 rands. But let me tell you something. I'll give you a certain miracle soup. You are going to bath. God is going to take every problem out. And I know this program, God is going to use me. Serious. So when you miss this program, night, you miss your blessing. Meet Nanapoku. Your life will never be the same. I love you too much. We shall meet there. Bye-bye. God bless you. God bless you. My name is Prophet Nanapoku number one. If you can see, I'm coming to Namibia. And I'm coming to shake Namibia very serious. Four days, powerful miracle manifestation. Beloved one, uh, I, I'm coming there on 31st. 31st, from 5 o'clock, the church has started in the, in the evening. 5 o'clock, the church has started. But on the 5th, it's Friday. It's all night. Beloved, Saturday, my God, is a service. We will start 5 o'clock the same evening. And let me tell you, Sunday is anointing service. The church will start 8 o'clock. Then I close 3 o'clock. Beloved, let me tell you something. When you are coming to the all night, which is Friday, night, don't forget, come with how much? $200 of uh, Namibian currency, yes, or 200 rands. But let me tell you something. I'll give you a certain miracle soup. You are going to bath. God is going to take every problem out. And I know this program, God is going to use me. Serious. So when you miss this program, night, you miss your blessing. Meet Nanapoku. Your life will never be the same. I love you too much. We shall meet there. Bye-bye. God bless you. God bless you. My name is Prophet Nanapoku. see i'm coming to namibia and i'm coming to shake namibia very serious four days powerful miracle manifestation beloved one uh, I, i'm coming there on 31st 31st from five o'clock the church has started in the in the evening five o'clock the church has started but on the first is friday it's all night beloved saturday my god is a service we will start five o'clock the same evening and let me tell you sunday is anointing service the church will start eight o'clock then i close three o'clock Beloved, let me tell you something. When you are coming to the all night, which is Friday, night, don't forget, come with how much? 
dollars of uh, Namibian currency, yes, or 200 rands. But let me tell you something. I'll give you a certain miracle soup. You are going to bath. God is going to take every problem out. And I know this program, God is going to use me serious. So when you miss this program, you miss your blessing. Meet Nanapoku. Your life will never be the same. I love you too much. We shall meet there. Bye-bye. Praise God. Hallelujah. God richly really bless you and bless your entire life. I have a very special invitation that I am about to give it to you. I am inviting you to Kingdom Prayer Ministry each and every time on Friday service. The theme of the service is Jericho Hour. My God, God is going to work in the name of Jesus. Prophet Danapuku and Kingdom Prayer Ministry is giving you very special invitation each and every time on Friday service. It is Jericho Hour, Jericho Hour and Jericho Hour. Beloved, come, let us pray to break any evil chain, any evil wall that is restricting you from your prosperity, from your financial breakthrough. Come and your life will never be the same. That, that is Friday service. The church starts at 5 p.m. in the evening, then we close exactly 12. I know as you are coming, any altar that is fighting against you shall be broken in the name of Jesus. Any financial stagnation shall be released in the name of Jesus. Any kind of burden upon your shoulders shall be taken off in the name of Jesus. It is Jericho hour, Jericho hour, and Jericho hour. It is happening each and every time on Friday service. That is Pretoria West, Rebecca and Charlotte Street. It will never be the same in the name of Jesus and your life is going to turn around. Make it a point. Come and meet senior major prophet, prophet Nanapoku, each and every time on Friday service. That is Jericho hour. And I know the God of Kingdom Prayer Ministry will answer you in the name of Jesus. God richly bless you. It is Jericho hour, Jericho hour and Jericho hour in Pretoria West, Rebecca and Charlotte Street and your life will never be the same. God richly bless you.
Ma jalo si anoba si chule asintweni esinzi ma jalo si a si chule asintweni esinzi ma jalo jalo si anoba. Testimony time. Testimony time. Blessing time. Because of the way we are live in Pretoria, we are in the center of Pretoria, in the church led by our father, Prophet Nanapoko. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. Amen. Without wasting any time, my sister, tell us your testimony. Where are you from? Are your name, please. I'm from Lesotho. I stay in Rustenburg. What, where I'm working. So, I've been going to church in Rustenburg. I was praying because I needed a child. I like to thank God. I'm pregnant. Hallelujah! Mama, are, are you saying you are pregnant now? We trail him, Mama. Serious? Somebody oh, give yes, Mama. So, Mama, how many months have you been looking for, for, for you to, to, to get a, a child? How many? Three months, ma. Yeah. 
But since you came here, something happened. No. Are, are you sure? Yeah. Hallelujah! Oh, yes. Power, 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 power. <laughs> Mama, without wasting any time, tell us your name and your testimony, please, Mama. My name is Marion Maluman. I come from Pretoria, yeah? Nel Mafias. I'm working there. Amen. Oh, yes. I will try to make it short, but it's a long testimony. Make it short. Amen. Uh, nearly month end of May, I bought a car, Almera Nissan. So I, I bought it cash. So I, put, I told myself that uh, I'll put everything inside that car. It didn't have a tracker and anything. So I told myself that I'm going to, when we close for school holidays, I'm going to start uh, taking care of that car for trigger and everything. So I put the car in the garage at home there. And then when we close, immediately when we close, on the 24th of September, I took the car to Silverton for service and everything for that car. And then I packed my car next to police station up there shell garage next to spa and then i went to garage to buy water and just want to eat something and for breakfast because it was early in the morning when i left the garage i went back to the car i didn't find that car mm. don't forget that car doesn't have tracker doesn't have anything it's just mm. a car oh yes when i arrived there i lost my mind i didn't believe that that car is gone I didn't go to that police station to open a case. I just cried. Mm. I said, God, why me? You know how I have done to collect money to buy that car because I told myself that I don't want to owe a car. It's mm. better I owe a house. I, I called the Uber. I went home. I left the police station there. I slept. I was not okay at all. The thing is, I got I saw. I told myself that even when I go to that police station to open a case, they won't believe me because I'm not normal. I slept that Saturday. I slept. I didn't even tell anyone, even my siblings. I slept on Sunday. I slept on Monday. I didn't go and open a case. Tuesday, I said no, man. Why don't I go to, to see Prophet Nanapuk one mm. by one? Number one. Oh, yes. I said to myself that the police won't help me, but I know God of Prophet Nanapuk will help me. Mm. I came here one on one on Wednesday. Don't forget, there's no case. Um, na, the, I didn't case open number. anything. When I arrived here, I felt peace. I, 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 I saw my car coming back. Mm. And then I went to one on one to Prophet. I said, Prophet, they took my car. And then Prophet just smiled and said, Ah, you know, you'll get your car. Amen. I, said, I said, Prophet doesn't understand in my heart. This car doesn't have a tracker, doesn't have anything. It's just a car. Mm. Prophet said, Mama, you're going to get your car. I'm going to pray for you. Amen. And then one nigam thunders. He prayed for me. He prayed for me and then he said to me, five days, go and use this for five days. You're going to get your car. It was Wednesday that day. When I arrived at home, I said, ah, that prophet, he didn't even touch me. Ah. <laughs> I wanted oh, him yes. to touch me, say, eh, here is your car, this address. Mm. I slept. I start using those prayers, praying, praying, praying. Hey, guys, God of Prophet Nanapuk. Oh, hey. yes. Monday, I said, ah, let me go to, Nan Monday next week, I call, I said, let me go to, I called the people of uh, insurance. That car only have insurance. Mm. And then I said, uh, my car is lost. Eh? What, 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 what? They said, send you a uh, certificate of the car, and we are going to send you a form to fill. I said, you people, 
The day you gave me that certificate, they, they courier it for me. me. They didn't come with the car that same day. Mm. So they courier it on the 23, and then the car was stolen in the 24. I said, ah, I put that certificate in the cabion. The car mm. went with everything, with everything. That's why I was telling myself that the police won't help me. But God of Prophet Nana will help me. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. Because of that certificate there. So I went to water license department. I said, hey, people of insurance say that I must claim my car. I must have that certificate. And then they said to me, let, let, I, I want to re register that, certif that car. And then they go to their office. They came back. They said, ah, mama. Your car doesn't belong to you anymore. It belonged to this white man in a certain garage. They are even selling it. They even uh, find a buyer. And then I didn't go that day. It was Tuesday. I said, I will go tomorrow. I, I believe, I trust God of Prophet Nana Pope will hold, Amen. Will hold that car. Amen. It won't go. And then on Wednesday, five days, don't forget prayers for five days. I went there to the garage in the morning. I, and then I passed like this at Montana. And then I passed like, I saw that car there. They were busy washing it with a price. It was about to go. Mm. And then I prayed. I prayed. I said, God of Prophet Nana Pope, don't let that car go. I can see that it's about to go. Don't let it go. And then I asked a certain man there who was working in the garage there. I said, I'm looking for a car. I want to buy a car. And then what about that car? I said, ah, that car, they already bought it, it's going. I called the police of Snowville. I said, please, come. I found my car, it has been stolen. It is here. They didn't give me any problem. When they arrived, they said, where is the car? I said, that one. And then they said, we're taking it. They took it. Now my car is back. <laughs> It can seem like is you are not understanding, ne? but there's something. If you lose hope in the prophetic, you are gone. Are you following? Papa, without waiting any time, tell us your name, your testimony, and where you're from, please. My name is Justice from Mokonya in Pretoria. Amen. I started this church while it was in Rustenburg. I was going to Rustenburg all the time. I had, I had a big problem every time when I go there. The doctors would write because I was injured, so I had to go to Sasa to get some money. 
When I got there, the doctor from Sansa would reject me. I was shot twice. So, Papa, you are saying there is a money they were waiting. There's money they were waiting. No, I was getting paid for. I went to Sasa to read. I was getting paid for. 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 I was getting paid so when I wanted to renew it, there was a problem. The doctor from the clinic would write a letter. Say go and get the money. I, I couldn't get that money at Sasa. On Good Friday in Rastenberg, they would pray for my letters for Sasa. Prophet Omega. He prayed for my letters. When I went back again, they gave me another date. They gave me dates twice. They reminded twice. When I went for the third time, the third time, the doctor didn't ask me anything. He just put my fingerprint. He didn't check anything. He didn't check anything. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. The prayers of this house. It's a miracle. I didn't do anything. Even the pills that I'm drinking for. Oh, yes. Jesus. They wrote. You know what it's here. You have a new name. Amen. Amen. I got a new name. Oh, yes. The God of the South. Oh, yes. Oh, power. Yes. This is the church. So the money is out. The money is out. The money is out. Hey. I got my money. Oh, yes. I'm going to give the prophet the right Oh, yes. Thank you, Papa. God bless you, Papa. Thank you, Papa. We serve a miracle. Waking God. We serve a miracle. Waking God. We serve a miracle. We serve a wonder. We serve a miracle. Waking God, oh, we serve a miracle. Waking God, we serve a miracle. Waking God, oh, we serve a miracle. We serve a wonder. We serve a miracle. Waking God. Amen. Hallelujah. Papa, give us a testimony. And hello, church. I'm Manuel Ngoma. I'm from Angola. Just sorry because I don't speak English very well. You must listen to me because I got a good testimony. Amen. You, you see, I was watching the TV and then I see the prophet was say, someone can he got a good heart must help when he was buried with the, the church. I take that uh, account number. I go, I deposit the money for this that account number. Only I call that number. I say, no, I didn't put the, num the money. I say, okay, no problem. And then uh, I got one sister. He's there by Israel. I did talk to him uh, maybe 27 years. But one day, one, one brother called me from Angola. No. Uh, uncle, send you, uh, take this number, call this number. When I call, call this number, was that sister. He said, Uncle, why are you doing there? He said, At this time, I don't do anything because I'm a truck driver. He said, Okay, no problem. Organize everything. You know, I got to send money for visa, for everything must come to, to here for Oasis. After two years, 
uh, after uh, three days, his sister, he said, you must go to the ambassador to ask how much, how much can send. I tell him the, the price. He sent 25,000 rand mm. to go to buy the visa. Amen. Oh, yes. And then he said, ah, this lady is the first time to talk to him. 27 ago. He sent me money. I go to the brother, I go to small man. Maybe you ask, and never, no one can help you. I say, This is for me, Prophet Anapoku. Amen. 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 I must go there to testify to see the Prophet because I'm a brother for the church, but in, on the TV. This Amen. is the first day I come here. When the church was there to Rattenberg, one day, because I'm living there by John Johnsburg. One day, he paid a ticket to go there. I didn't find the prophet. And then, this time, when I organized for that travel, he said, no, I want to go to see the church and then to see the prophet. But I remember every Sunday, I watch the TV, like I'm here inside the church. Amen. Okay. Amen. God bless you, Papa. God bless you, Papa. My sister, without any waste of time, tell us your testimony. Where are you from? In your name, please. My name is Onzamiti Marwang. I come from Botswana, but uh, I come and fellowship here. Uh, I take this time to thank the Lord for the man of God here, who the Lord showed me uh, for my salvation. I thank the Lord very much. Amen. And I'd like to thank God for the rest of church. Uh, and I'd like to urge the church that uh, we are living in the last days. The Lord, the coming of the Lord is very imminent. Coming to church is not only for prosperity, for eating, for those things. We should take coming to church very serious. The devil is only also working very hard for his kingdom because there are two kingdoms. The kingdom of light, the kingdom of God, and the kingdom of darkness. And in these two kingdoms, just only one kingdom shall prevail, and then we have new Jerusalem. And I'd like to thank God. Everybody who is here is not here by chance. We are here because of the utterance of the Holy Spirit. Amen. You know, every service that you come, you should appreciate when you have chance, you come and you follow the instruction. The, the God operates through men of God. He mm. resides in the, the headquarters of his heart. When he utters something, he's the mouthpiece of God. Don't take it that it's coming from him. It's God who's speaking. You know, in spirituality, God resides in heaven. Devil resides in hell. In spiritual law, God cannot come to earth, come here in person, but he sends a vessel. And all of us as your children of God, he abides in our, in our hearts. The Holy Spirit works within the, within the hearts. That's where we get our direction. As we are here, take it very serious. We are living in the last days. You are not here by chance. Work your own salvation with all diligence. And I like the teaching of Friday because... The prophet, everybody who mean everybody here, even all of us, we are very special. God mm. sent us for a purpose, function, of which when we leave this earth, we have to account for everything that we are sent to. We are not here just for marriage, just for eating, just for work. Those things are a package for us to reach our destinies. Amen. So it is very sad that we come here and doing all those things, and yet we are very conscious of uh, ensuring our bodies, not to ensure our spirits. And I find it very special that you, 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 you ensure your spirit because it's where you are the rest of eternity. Imagine if you go there, you find yourself there, but you are not prepared and you go the wrong direction. You can't say, let me go back, Lord. It's done. You are there. So as we are here, I, we, we should be serious about it. But now, what I'd like to say is now, uh, uh, in these last days, we overcome by the words of our testimonies and Amen. by the blood of the Lamb, mm. Revelations 12, 11. And as we came, like on Friday, the teaching was that we should pray every time so that the inner man can overcome the flesh. It was the teaching of Friday that the prophet, the, uh, that the, the one of the ministers in the house was giving us. And then the prophet himself at the end of the service said, Buy ministry material. Don't take it like as they, they call on the, the call of the altar. Buy water. Buy salt. You take it very simple. God addresses us and our families here. Mm. Here is where we get, we get the strength. When you go there, we are going for 
battlefield. The battlefield is where we are going. When you go out there in a workplace, in your house, everywhere, that's where the work starts. When you are equipped here, get the message, put it into practice. Every time you come here to be fortified, and then you go back to the, to the, to the battlefield. The man of God says, by the water, then I just, just the, the, the spirit of obedience, listening and acting, not to be stubborn, it helps. You see that obedience will help you to overcome almost everything through obedience. So the man of God said, by water. Then God said, the power of God said, don't forget by water. Then I obeyed and went, and then we prayed there. Little did I know that I had an encounter yeah, um, yesterday, no, the day before, yeah, on Friday, I had an encounter. I resided in one of the guest house there. So it's, it's a, a well-guarded area with security, with everything. Then before I sleep, I heard a knock. And somebody, was, I, was, I locked myself inside. I heard a knock. And somebody was using a key, another key outside, trying to, to, to unlock. Very busy, trying to unlock. So I started physically. I used a voice. I challenged and said, who is that? Then there was no answer. Busy. They were wanting to open. Then immediately, because of God, God always protect us, something came into my mind and said, ah, I grabbed that water. The only thing that I could see now was that water. You took grab this water. Mm. I grabbed that water. You know what I did? I didn't talk this time. I took the water, sprinkled hard on the, on the, on the door. Amen. Immediately, physically, that ceased. So it's, it shows that that was supernatural. It was not only physical. You see, just obedience saves you from a lot of things. You take it for granted. Buy this. Put everything that you hear. Make sure that you grab it. Put it in practice as you go because you are paving. Oh, the yes. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Amen. We save a miracle waking God. We save a miracle Waking God, we save the miracle, we save the wonder, we save the miracle, 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 we save we save the miracle, we save the miracle, we save the miracle, My sister, without any waste of time, tell us your name, your, where you're from, and your testimony, please. Um, from Kruger Stop. Um, on 24th June, I dreamt prophet. I was telling him my problems in the dream. And on Friday, Saturday, 23, the 23rd, I was at work. I was sick, had a severe headache, and a bit of flu. On Saturday, my aunt took me to the hospital. They admitted me. And then uh, I had a back pain and, and a headache, flu, a bit of flu. And then bang admita, they admitted me. And then on Sunday, Sunday I dreamt Prophet Omega uh, praying for me. After praying the following day, Monday, on the Monday, I was discharged from hospital. And then Amen. I started vomiting after I was discharged. And then medication on even the medication was making worse. And then on Thursday, on Thursday I came to and church. And then I came to church. I Bishop Zondo. I saw Bishop Zondo. As and then the bishop asked the ashes to time with the And then cloth. after some few minutes, mm -hmm. said stood up. And then it became And I did. Uh, problem again, I had a problem with my spine. Every time when I walk, I would hear pain in my legs and my spine. I couldn't walk well. Uh, even when I get the way, 
Sometimes Sometimes when I couldn't even wear my shoes. I didn't know what the pain how the pain was. Before Prophet came and uh, Bishop Zonda, I had a bit of a stroke in, in church. My mouth started turning. And then life after Prophet Bishop Zondo after Bishop Zondo prayed for me. And then we get love again for all night prayer. I came for all night prayer. And then on all night prayer, Prophet Arikisa Han. Prophet gave us honey, <laughs> miracle honey. I bought miracle and honey. Saturday we get I didn't use it on Saturday. Sunday. I used it on Sunday. After that honey, the vomiting, the headache, the spine cake, everything, everything disappeared. They checked my sugar diabetes. Oh, yes, pal. I, I nearly died. I nearly died. Amen. And I Amen. thank this church. Amen. Amen. Oh, yes. Viewers all of the world, we are live in Pretoria. Next, uh, we are just next to the school and next to the buildings, which the street is Charlotte and Rebecca Street. We are about to welcome the prophet. Uh, we are about to welcome the prophet. Can we just stand up? Can we just stand up? Can oh, stand up? yes. Kinako. Are you ready for the prophet? Oh, yes. yes. Are you ready for the prophet? Yes. yes. Kinako. Oh, yes. Are you ready? Yes. yes. You can scream. You can dance. You can do whatever. The prophet is ready. The oh, prophet yes. is loaded. Are you ready? We are ready. Are you ready? Oh, yes. We are about to welcome the prophet. We are going to welcome the prophet. Welcome the prophet. Can you open the prophet? Can you open the prophet? Can you open the prophet? Can you welcome the prophet? The general! The general! King of prophetic! Prophet Nanapoko! Let me see your hands! Jump! 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 I'm not gonna worry anymore! I'm not gonna cry no more! I'm just gonna stand and believe! Receive my victory. I'm not gonna worry anymore. I'm not gonna cry no more. I'm just gonna stand and believe and receive my victory. I'm gonna lift up my eyes and to the hills. Where my help is coming from. I'm gonna lift up my eyes and to the hills. Where my help is coming from. together for Jesus Christ. Let me see your hands. Say, I am blessed in the name of Jesus. I am blessed in the name of Jesus. Say, I am blessed in the name of blessed. Jesus. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Are you okay? Are you fine? God bless everyone sitting here. I believe in God. You are blessed in the sight of God. And every problem that you brought here, at the end of this service, God will sort the problem out for you. Say amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 
Maybe somebody is watching me on Facebook or YouTube. Hallelujah. I'm coming to, I'm going to uh, Namibia. Mm. Hallelujah. Amen. Is this month ending eh? or next month? Say amen. Next month ending. Not, not ending, ending. It's 31st, 1st, 2nd, 3rd. Huh? 31st. Hallelujah. 31st of this month. Ah. 31st of August. Then I finish. Ah, okay. And September, t September is no more tears. Put your hands together for Jesus. This church, this church, we do uh, three programs every year. Hallelujah. Amen. And the programs are very massive. The one we did yesterday was not the program. Hallelujah. Amen. We just moved to this place. So we wanted to revive and see what God has for you. Say amen. So put it in your mind. There's a program here, which is September. No more tears. Very soon you see the advert say amen. Amen. And I heard that the women are doing some conference. It's only women. So men don't attend. So if I wear makeup and I put wig. <laughs> and I come. Are they going to chase me out? <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. I'll make sure I'll be here. Because they say woman. Hallelujah. So I'll make sure I'll dress, I'll use makeup. I'll put a wig. Hallelujah. Amen. I saw a certain pastor was doing the same, so me too, I'll do the same. Amen. I'll put a wig, nice wig, then I'll put to my woman clothes. Then I'll put high heel. So the woman program, make sure you'll be here. If you're a woman, you are watching me in the house, you couldn't come to church. Make sure that you'll be here. It's which date? Which? 12 of what? August. That means left for a month. This month. Next, Next month. month. Amen. I'll make sure that I'll be here. So all the women must be here. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. God bless everyone sitting here. Amen. I believe in God. The testimony you are expecting, may, they, may you get it in the name of Jesus. I receive. Amen. Amen. Elder, you remember when I was coming, I said, I need the changes. Ne? Amen. Kofi, I'm serious. Ne? Find somebody who can play the instrument, every instrument for me. Because these people, I don't like them anymore. You know, they are old enough for you to talk, then somebody will say, He's disrespecting me.
the beginning and the end. Speak through me and work through me. Don't let me use my wisdom, my knowledge to speak to your people. But create me a new spirit. In the name of Jesus, let us just say amen. Amen. Put your hands together for Jesus. Take the Bible to Numbers chapter 21, verse number 4. Numbers 21, verse 4. We have some people who don't have Bible in the church. Hallelujah. Amen. I will make sure that I will bless each and everyone before you leave here. Numbers chapter 4. I 21, verse 4. Sorry. <clears throat> and they journeyed from Mount Hor by the way of the Red Sea mm -hmm. to compass the land of Edom. Mm -hmm. And the soul of the people was much discouraged because of the way. Mm -hmm. And the people spake against God oh, and mm -hmm. against Moses. Yes. Wherefore have ye brought us up out of Egypt mm -hmm. to die in the wilderness? For if there is no bread, neither there is any water. Mm. And our soul loweth this light bread. Yes. And the Lord sent fiery serpents among mm -hmm. people. And they beat the people. Lord sent what? Fiery serpents. Uh -huh. And much people of Israel died. Mm -hmm. Therefore, the people came to Moses mm. and said, We have sinned, mm. for we have spoken against the Lord yes. and against thee. Mm. Pray unto the Lord uh -huh. that he take away the serpents from us. Mm. And Moses prayed for the people. Mm. And the Lord said unto Moses, uh -huh. Make thee a fiery serpent yes. and send it upon a pole. Mm. And it shall come to pass that every one that is beaten, mm. when he looketh upon it, mm. shall live. Amen. Amen. Put your hands together for Jesus. <laughs> Hallelujah. When you start from Exodus, Numbers, Leviticus, say Amen. Amen. The throne of Joshua. All the side talk about Moses. I think Moses wrote all the the, the, uh, the scripture. Hallelujah. When I read the Bible from Exodus, there's something that I have seen in the Bible that always Israelites, when they got in small problem, they talk against God. Mm. Say Amen. Amen. Anytime when they started getting problem, they always get angry for Moses and God. I remember when they were in, uh, when they were going to drink the Mara water, the Bible said they were talking against God and Moses. Amen. That is there in no, any place in uh, Egypt. When we die, you bury us there and you brought us here just for us to die. Say Amen. Amen. So it's every time the word that they always said. So one day God spoke to them that the way you speak bad in my ears, I'll let the bad come unto you. Say amen. Amen. So if you're a child of God and always you are there, make sure that no matter how what the problem going through, know that it's God who has set the trap against you and he have a way to take you out. Say amen. Amen. Yes, sir, I was telling somebody that I mean from now, or these days, anything that happened to me, either is a good or bad. I said, it's God who has created. Say, Amen. Amen. I want to tell you something. They, they started talking against God when they were in the wilderness. And the God himself. You know, anytime, some people think and say, Prophet, I got a dream. And the dream I saw, I saw a snake. He don't know the kind of snake he saw. Every snake is a Satan. It's not like that. Say, Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hey, hey, somebody got my point. Every snake is not a Satan. It depends what you see. Say amen. Mm. Somebody can prophet, I saw a dog. I saw a white dog. A dog is a demon, so it's a demon. It's not like that. It depends the color and how the dream was. Hallelujah. Is somebody getting my point? Amen, Papa. Mm -hmm. When you see a white dog, white dog is not a demon. White dog represents angel of God. Say amen. Amen. Papa. I want to put it in your mind. Hallelujah. And the snake, the, you know, God always, God have. Uh, angels who always do bad things as if they are demons. Is hey, hey, somebody getting my point? In the time of Moses, when God is about to deliver Israelites, Bible says God sent flocks, God sent flies. Hallelujah. Mm. 
I've sat down and I see that all those that God sent to them was not a demonic spirit because then time there was no flies around the world. See, and there was Amen. no money. But this one that they came to uh, Egypt, they were a lot. Hallelujah. Amen. I see that they were not just uh, uh, flies. It's an angels of God. See, I mean, because God has a spirit that can spoil things, a spirit that can do things nice. Hallelujah. So when you check Saul, Saul was a king. Bible said Saul was having demonic spirit. Hallelujah. That demonic spirit is not anyone who gave it to him. It's God who gave it to him. Mm. And somebody follow me. Amen. So God have those spirit in heaven. When he want to destroy you, he send those things to you. Hallelujah. Amen. And sometimes the eyes of God is upon his children. Mm. If your time is not up yet, put it in your mind that God will make a time for you one day. Hallelujah. My God. If you see things are not working, tell yourself that my time is on the way coming. Hallelujah. Mm. But don't give up and look upon any one person or look a blessing from any other person. Because I studied that this word, anyone who try to help you will give up on you. Hallelujah. Amen. Anyone who try to help you, the person will give up on you. I can't remember, they chased me from one church and I went to another church. When the pastor see me, he see Jesus. <laughs> Hallelujah. A villager like me, oh, the pastor see Jesus, when he see me, make Mele, Mele, uh, holy, holy Mele. Hallelujah. Amen. It, it didn't take long time. The pastor chased me out. We chased me in Bazooka. Say amen. Amen. Did somebody got my point? And he chased us at midnight, two o'clock. Hallelujah. And when you are chasing you, then time you don't have any bag. Me, my bag was looking like a soldier bag, brother. It's at my back, two o'clock. Amen. Amen. You know, human beings can like you today, mm. but today they can reject you, but don't care for that. Because if somebody, listen, if somebody knows you are beginning, listen. I was telling Bishop Zondo yesterday, hallelujah. Amen. I went to mountains, a certain place, Ghana. That is when Bolo was saying nonsense that you go there for our powers. Mm. Hallelujah. Amen. Let, I will talk about the mountains to you right now. Hallelujah. Amen. I spent one month, two weeks there. COVID, me, my life, those who are sitting in the church, nobody has do fasting than me. See, amen. Amen. That is why you, if you are with me, you can see that me, I'm not somebody who always learn Bible. But every word that I bring is unique. Amen. I learned Bible when I was young at the table. In terms of, I make fasting in that mountains. My food finished. Hallelujah. Mm. And I stuck on the mountain. I cannot walk because when you see my, my, my ribs here, you can count all of them. They put me in the basket. And they carry me on top of a mountain. And the guy told me I must not shake myself. All of us will fall down. And I make like this. My God. Steve. Is somebody follow me? We are following Papa. So, maybe that time, when we say take care of Nanapuku for one day, to mm. reject Nanapuku. Is somebody get to my point? Amen. Sister, let me tell you something. For now, nobody need you as a friend. Mm. But just accept it like that. My God. Those who don't need you today, there will be a time they will think. You know, we have so many people in this house. Né? Mm. The amount of things that I wish Nanapuku is my friend. But there was a time when they give me two to keep me for one day. You reject me. See, let me tell you something. Mm. So anytime, anything that comes to your life, it is a rejection or acceptance. Just accept anything that is from God. Is somebody get my point? Hallelujah. Amen. Are you getting my point? I was talking about mountain. Amen. Amen. In the olden days, if God wants to speak to his people, he speaks to his people through the mountains. Is somebody get to my point? Yes, Papa. Moses, before you get the Ten Commandments, mm. Moses went to a certain mountain called Mountain Sinai. Is somebody follow me? We are following, Papa. I want to tell you something. Why mountains? Because Jesus can't even do the same. He went to mountains with uh, Peter and the rest. They were three. Say amen. Amen. Papa said, Angel of God revealed himself to them. I think Moses, uh, Abraham, and Elijah. Hallelujah. Amen. So Peter said, Jesus, Jesus we, we need to make a tent here. Listen, mountains, when you go to mountains, né, let me put something in your mind. There was no food there. There was no water. Say amen. Amen. That is where you, your mind can connect to God. 
Is somebody follow me? You are following, Papa. Because when you go there, your mind can be sound. Me, I've been in mountains for a long time. Somebody can look at me and say, this one is not from God. You know, if people don't know your beginning, eh, mm. and when you prosper, and they start talking against you, don't listen to their nonsense, because you came from a certain far place. My God. <laughs> Ada, you know what, me, I came from a far place, so mm. this time, as God has blessed me, I don't listen what people say about me. Hey. Because I know where I went and where I'm coming from. My God. And if you know where you're coming from, you don't entertain nonsense. Mm. Mm. Uh, somebody follow me. You are following, Papa. Any time when I see I have, have me, I was not a prophet. Too. Mm. I was not a prophet. I'm somebody who hated prophets. <laughs> Baby Joshua is not now. He came. He came about 1995. That's the time you see somebody, you hold the person like this man is using demonic powers. <laughs> Say amen. Amen. When you tell somebody the person can, because I was evangelist. I was a young evangelist in Ghana. I want to put your man somewhere. Then that's why sometimes you know I'm going to do a certain program then. I will go to Ghana. I will go with those who are partner for the church. Amen. I will go purposely for them. Mm. Say amen. Is somebody getting my point? Because some of the people, ne, they are paving a way for the, for the work of God. Amen. And we, too, we need to take care serious for them. They, we must let them see that after all what they have contributed, God is still love them and the door must open for their life. Hallelujah. Hey, hey, somebody follow me. We are following Baba. Bible said they talk against God. The snake that God sent. Hallelujah. Amen. That snake was very powerful. Just to bite his eyes. Mm. Last time I was saying something, one guy was saying, Prophet, why are you saying that? I said, God and Jesus, they are wicked more than Satan. Say, Amen. Amen. Bible said, the devil came to kill. I never see Satan has killed more than 500 people the same time before. Mm. He can kill a soul, but he cannot keep the soul. He Amen. can kill the flesh, but he cannot kill the, uh, the soul. Say, Amen. Amen. But when God get angry about uh, Israelites, mm. he can open on the ground. My God. He put about 400,000 people inside. Then he close it. Mm. He, God himself is very wicked, so don't take him for granted. When he says he's striking on your enemy, sister, you beg for your enemy, but he will, he will never listen to you. Amen. Is hey, somebody getting my point? We are following, Papa. Snake started biting them. Mm. And the snake is not from God. It's not Satan, but the snake is God. Amen. Is somebody following me? You are following, Papa. I said, from now on, even if you go and commit sin, and they caught you and they beat you, you didn't die. Say, God, you are the one who created it. Is somebody get my point? You are following, Papa. I can't remember. I was preaching against Muslims. Then I was about 17 years. Mm. And the Muslims started beating me. My God. This, that, some of the beatings that you can't defend yourself. With. Because this one hit you. You go here. This one hit you. And I'm looking for a way to run away because they are about to kill me. Say amen. Amen, Baba. <laughs> Sister, I ran to the point that I set in a, a, a big hole. Kofi, I fall inside and me, my life. The animal that I'm afraid, I'm scared of my life is what? It's rats. I told myself better for them to kill me rather than me coming to slay in the rats. The way Muslims beat me in a sister. Don't you see people are taking cheese cups and I want to make cheese cups. Oh. But when I remove my hair, eh, the scars in my hair is like eh, 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 eh. it's like they green my hair before. Amen. Sometimes I went on another book, he's a gentle guy, he's very nice. Sister, if I remove my leg for you, mm. it's like a chicken leg, I'm telling you. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Anything that happened to you, a Christian or a child of God life, it doesn't matter who you created or somebody created for you, but tell yourself that this thing is paving a way hey, of hey. testimony for my life. Say, hey. hey, somebody getting my points. 
you are following Papa. They speak against God and God said, no, I need to teach. You know, when God sent the snake or when God is killing them, not like God is ang anger is on them, but God has punishing them as his own children. Mm. Say amen. Amen. And what I saw about Israelites, they were, they were, they, they, they like problem, but when the problem is coming, they run away. Mm. They are like bazooka. Say amen. Maybe he's watching me, he's not my friend. Because he took Shadrach, Meshach, Abednego from the fire. Amen. So when God put you in trouble, hey. say, God, you are making me become strong and faith. Hey. When God put you in trouble, hey. say, God, you are paving a way of my testimony. Hey. When the trouble and affliction come, hey. say, God, you are paving a way for my enemies my God. to bow down their head huh? in front of my life. Say, hey. Amen. So when problem come, beloved one, stay and stand. Hallelujah. Amen. You have so many pastors because of problem. Mm. They run away. Bushil is not one of them. Bushil is South African government chase him out. Amen. Because he was taking over ZCC and the rest church members. Amen. I'm telling the truth. And, and listen, and South African government, the, the president. No. Amen. That's why I'm not afraid of anything. Mm. If you're a child of God, take fear out from your life. Amen. Me the reason why I'm not afraid of anything. When you hit my face, my, my face didn't swell. It's the same. Mm. Because they have been beating me in my life a lot. And me too, I beat a lot. So my body has closer. Because when you put iron rust, it's not getting inside. Hallelujah. Put hands together for Jesus Christ. Amen. Many pastors couldn't say. Mm. Why? Because some of them got a problem. And they can see that the problem is more beyond on them. So some of them run away. But if you're a child of God eh, and you stand in front of problem as Job, you know, Amen. God will lift you to the highest ground. The same. Why nobody in your family has been there before? Amen. I speak as a prophet of God. My God. May you stand on this problem. Huh? And may this problem become your promotion. Arce. May this problem become your exams. Arce. But the power of the Holy Ghost 
I speak as an oracle of God. I go. I say after this problem, say, God is promoting your life. I see. After this problem, I go. He's taking somebody hey. to another level. I see. But the power and the Holy Ghost. Amen. Sit down. Say Amen. Sister, listen. Mm. Jesus Christ, He's everywhere. Amen. Jesus Christ, the Son of God, I understand. Mm. One day, one Jehovah Witness, the member came. Me, if you are reading Bible and you come to me and make Bible studies, don't think you are going to take your church doctrine mm. to pull me for me to believe you. The same. It will be debate the whole of the day. Mm. One Jehovah Witness lady came to my house. Coffee, I could lock the door. We are there from morning to evening because when he say I don't understand. And when I say she don't understand, he said, I'm going, I'm coming. And I left the lady, left the Bible there. The Bible is in my house now. Say amen. Amen. Are, are you getting my point? We are following, Papa. Some of the, you know, some of the churches, you don't have to go there. I'm telling the truth. Jehovah Witness is not a church. Mm. It's a society. Don't go there. When they give you papers, you know, the tracks, the house tracks. First of all, they call them watch tower. And their name is Who's a Light? Mm. The person who established the church, 1980 something, and he established the church. That Who's a Light was in the this church, I think, uh, Baptist Church. Say Amen. Amen. And he steal money. He was a general secretary. He steal money, and they chase him out. Mm. So he established his own church. That watch tower. Who's a Light? Their teaching is that in the olden days, mm. you can touch anything, nothing Amen. can happen to you. Hallelujah. Amen. If you get their tracks, you see that somebody stand on the lion, then the lion make like, hey. Then they say, have you seen the, the snake? He's licking the lady hand. That's what end of the day to be. This is the end of the day. Amen. So if the whole witness pastor said, this is the end of the day, brother, zoo is here. Let's go to zoo. Let's find one lion. You see how your testicles are lost, I'm telling you. Put your hands together for Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Let's put it aside. Mm. The mountains is where Moses went. Mm. And Jesus Christ went to mountains. And Jesus disciples, they didn't go to mountains. Mm. But they climbed story building. Mm. Hallelujah. Amen. Which is uh, when Jesus pro uh, promised them that you must go uh, 40 days. They were seeing the John Mike, his mother's story building. Every mountain is mountain. What you know is you lift your eyes. Because David said, I will lift my eyes mm. onto that mountain. You know, when you lift your eyes, there's mm. no other person you see apart from what? Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. I want to put your mind somewhere. He said, uh, in the, the, the beginning, there was a word. And the word was with God. He didn't, uh, you know, when we listen, say, and the word become flesh, that is Jesus Christ. It's true. Hallelujah. Amen. Jesus Christ, let me put your mind. Jesus Christ saw Abraham before. When three angels, Bible says angels, it's not angels, it's God himself. Jesus Christ and Holy Spirit. So Jesus said, Bible says, Jesus said, when Abraham saw me, mm. he was happy. That means Abraham was there. Say Hey, somebody follow my, my way. I want to put your mind somewhere. Sister, wherever you go, I said, sometimes you don't need to even call God himself because God, let God stay in his kingdom Amen. and leave everything to Jesus Christ. Amen. Because he said, I am the way, truth, and the life. And the life. No man come to the Father except me, Jesus Christ. Say. Ah, uh, is somebody getting my point? We are following you, Papa. So when that serpent or the snake bites you, mm. there's somebody who can take the venom on or venom from your skin. That is Jesus Christ because he came and take our problem out. Mm. He came and heal us from sickness. He came and resurrect us from death. Amen. But I want to tell you something. The when the snake bites you on the desert, hey. 
there's no one that you must lift your eye. Huh? Hallelujah. Because my Bible make him understand huh? my God. that God told Moses huh? hey. to make a copper snake. Say. That copper snake was Jesus Christ. My God. When you lift your eye onto the mountain, huh? mm. you will see the snake. Hey. And when you see the snake, you have saved. Amen. Hey, somebody get my point. We are following Papa. When you check the snake, her sister, don't lift your eye anywhere. We have those who lift their eye on the ground. Allah wa kubad, don't mind them. But lift your eye onto where? When I'm talking about the mountain, Bible said he make a, 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 a tree, mm. a stick, and he put the copper, copper a, 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 a snake Amen. on top of it. That anyone who get the biting of the snake, mm. he must look onto the, the, the big snake. That big snake, the way they have hung the snake on that cloth, mm. is the same as Jesus Christ. Is somebody getting my point? We are following Papa. And automatically, let's take the snake out. Mm. And let's lift our eye onto the mountains. And we see three cross on top of the mountains. Mm. And there's other one in the middle. <laughs> Is somebody getting my point? We are following Papa. God took the snake out from the desert. Uh, say. And he made the snake to become a what? A flesh. He made. Listen, Jesus can turn himself as anything. Mm. Sister, from now on, uh, the person that you have to put yourself... You must rely on is Jesus Christ. Mm. Because I see this word, nobody in this life can change your life. Amen. Nobody can change your destiny. Somebody can say, I'll give you a job. Amen. But the person will collect bribe from you. Say. But when God is about to do something for you, Amen. he don't need permission from any kind of your family members. Amen. He don't ask your friend, I want to bless this one. But God bless from his own heart. Sir. Say. Since I want to tell you something. He's not expecting those who are rich. Mm. He's not expecting those who have money. Mm. But he's expecting those who are poor. Amen. Who don't have anything. Say. Because he came to take the debts. Hey. The debt it is hey. out from the bowl hey. so that will make you sleep inside. Hey. So every problem that will have put on you, my God, not that it's a debt that God came and saved it. My God, I say sickness is debt, okay? Amen. Failure is a debt in your life. Amen. I speak as a prophet of God. The same. May the Lord God take every problem, hey. every sickness, Amen. every debt Amen. out from your life. Amen. And when you need the help, Hey. Lift your eye onto the mountains. The say where the blessing coming from. My God. It's coming from Jehovah. Amen. The Savior. Hey. The Master of Universe. The Son of uh, Joseph. Jesus. The Son of Mary. Jesus. Master of Universe. Jesus. Jesus, Jesus Christ. Hey. The one who came and take your sin. The say. He said, I am the way. Hey. Yeah, 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 yeah. No man. He said, no man come to the Father. Amen. Sister, I want to tell you something. From now, you are not the head, but you are going to lead your family. Amen. In the name of Jesus. I receive. Sit down. Sit down. Too much revelation. If you are sin, Amen. There's a mountain here. Mm. There's a cross here. Bible says, God instructs them. That whosoever watch the snake, mm. the person will save. He came and take you out from a sin. Mm. In the olden days, I said, when a problem come and you kill a sheep, the blood of sheep and the blood of the lamb, the blood of the bed, it just covered the sin. Mm. Is somebody get my point? We are following Papa. In the olden days, you were sick. Say, God, heal me. God just recover the sickness. Mm. Every year, the sickness come back again. Amen. But there's somebody who came and poured his blood. You know? Say. That person came and take all, he came and take all your stress, all your problem, mm. all your sin out from your life. Amen. He is Jehovah Jesus Christ. Amen. He is the Lord of the Lord. Mm. Let me put your mind somewhere. You know, when you come to church, you know, what you have to expect is the word of God. It's not the prophecy. It's not how your problem can go because God has already told you that your problem is out before you come here. Amen. So what you have to expect is the re good result of your life. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So many people are sitting here. I know nothing is going on for you. But lift your eyes onto the mountains. Amen. 
there's any one that you cannot look. Mm. When you look at your mother, your mother will turn back to you. When you look at your father, your father will turn back to you. Mm. But look unto the mountains. Jesus Christ, he's the savior. He came and saved you from the depth. Amen. He came and saved you mm. from the depth. So those who have them, how many people have depth here? You own bank, hallelujah. You own bank, let me see your hands. Uh, I, I, I'm a prophet of God. Amen. I'm going to pray for you right now. Amen. May the Lord God take every depth out from your life. I see. Because Jesus said, by my stripes, that pay your debt. Sister, lift your eye onto the band. Anyone who will lift their eyes, mm. that person must be saved. Amen. Sister, you know me, I defend my leader every day. There's no any leader that Jesus, he leave you for us. You have many, many churches, mm. many, many leaders, but he's the leader of leaders. Amen. Hallelujah. And those churches, all their leaders, no one leave them power, as I told you last time. No one give you power, but Jesus Christ, when he was living, he said, I'm not going to leave you as an orphan. Mm. Say amen. Amen. I will send the Holy Spirit to you. I want to tell you something, beloved one, this morning. We have those people, when the problem comes, they started talking to people too much. I don't have money, you know, my husband, everybody will know that your husband has beat you. That's how some people, they don't know how to talk to Jesus Christ. Mm. He talk to everybody, everybody know his problem. Sister, let that you are taught gossip, ne? just speak to God. Amen. Lift your man says, God, I'm telling you this. Mm. I don't have any hope. You are my hope. God, I'm telling you this. I don't have any money. You are my bank. My God. Sister, don't, you know what? I want to put your mind somewhere. I was learning something. Eh? Those who used to say, hey, now, uh, God has blessed me. Uh, my, my brother is a president. Mm. My father is a government. My father is a mayor. Remove your eyes from them. Eh? I was watching something about Obama. Hallelujah. Amen. Obama, the family house where he grew up is still there. And his brother is here, hobo. Smoking uh, this thing, uh, that glue. I watch him. Say amen. amen. So sometimes then when God bless your brother, then don't say God has blessed us. Tell you, I said that my time is on the way coming. Amen. Hey, somebody get my point. Because he, he can be a president, but he can never remember you. Mm. Say amen. Amen. Hey, somebody get my point. He can be a president, but he can never do what? Remember me. Then you are, you are the friend of President Zuma. You are the who cleaned the shoes in the school. Then now you go there. Hey, Zuma. <laughs> I'm here. You are friend, Sashenko. Hey, sister. I'll go to President Ramaphosa house. The schoolmate, then time you have a certain uh, 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 where she used to talk to him. Then go, hey, Rama. I'm here. <laughs> hey, you don't remember school time. It's me. Sister, the moment you come, you say Raman, eh? the way a certain soldier will slap you. Ne? Amen. <laughs> number, number. <laughs> Your house, the road is here, then you are going here. I can't remember a certain guy slapped me. Ne? I think I'm taking stone to throw it. I'll take plastic. Eh? Hallelujah. Amen. You cannot go there. Say amen. Amen. Let me put your man somewhere. Mm. Where God is taking you there. Eh? Amen. Some of the people you see today, hey. they can never see you in future. I receive. Some of them was right and let them before they see you. I receive. So those who don't know me today, hey. begin to look at me today. Look at my parents today. That's look hey. at my face today. Uh. Because tomorrow by this time, hey. You are going to sign a paper before you see me. I'm telling the truth. Amen. Say amen. Amen. Sister, somebody is living with you now. Mm. You are not the same, I'm telling you. You can be in the one class today. Mm. But the class that God wants to put you in, mm. nobody, even your teacher, cannot reach there. I receive. Hallelujah. I receive. I went to Ghana. Then, my friends. 
Hey, Jaule. I said, hey, stop that village thing. You know what? Sometimes when you move with you, listen, when you move, when you, listen. Number, number. <laughs> when, listen, listen. When you move with the villagers, ne? Hey, listen. If God didn't connect you to some people, ne? Mm. You'll be in that side for a long time. Say amen. Amen. I said in the class, ne, they call me Jahule. Baba Jahule. That was my nickname. Every stubborn boy, the name is not simple. Baba Jahule. My God. Say amen. Amen. Oh, I went to Ghana. You know, some of the people who see you today, and I said there will be a time before they see you, ne? They will get, they will say, people that I want to see, they will book appointment mm, mm. before they can meet you, okay? Amen. That's why I say, that sometimes when you are working, work nice. When you are talking, talk, because God is taking you to a certain level. Start, start learning the nice word from people. Mm. Say, Amen. Amen. Because I said that, you know what, listen, sit down. I said this, I, I told you last time. Some of the words of Zulu and Swana, eh, when you speak to somebody, you, you can get a lot of fight. Oh, last time, brother, not that the guy never go to school, he's a Zulu guy. Oh. Mm. And I step on his leg, hey, man, hey, man, hey, Samaya. Uh, listen, listen. And I become like a gentle guy, and I, oh, excuse me. It's okay, I hear. You know, some of the English, you know, mm. when you make it nice, even if it's a fight, it's not a fight to you. Amen. Sister, when God is blessing you, even your tone, you have to change it. You are walking, the way you talk, mm. it must change because That's God right. is taking you to another level. <laughs> Bible said when David was coming from the forest, the mother and the family, they couldn't recognize David mm. because where the God put him, God changed his destiny before people saw him. Amen. I came from my car. Uh, my class, oh, class. Baba Jaule, Baba Jaze, all of you stop that to are relating. That's why I'm not talking to you. Say amen. Amen. Don't you know I'm in South Africa? You are level and them, their level is not the same. Now I'm not in your level, you are villagers. I'm in the level of South Africa. My God. Hallelujah. Amen. Hey, anyone who is here, eh, you can see your life is not stagnant. Things are not okay. Thank God. Your time is on the way coming. I receive. I receive. When you see you become poor. Mm. You have been praying, but the property spirit still follow you. Mm. Give thanks to God, okay? Amen. Because God is about to do a certain miracle in your life. I receive. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Sister, I'm telling the truth. Mm. Sometimes I change your hands. I know you don't have the money yet, but let the devil who hit you know that this person, the atmosphere has changed for him. Amen. 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 At village. Well, that, that time, the TV was black and white, you know. And I went to the city. I saw those who are uh, preparing TV. I saw a certain TV, big one. I said, brother, this TV, I used to say, no, it has spoiled, you can take it. Adam. And I took the TV. I came and I put it in front of our, 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 our cupboard. I put lace. And I said to you people, we have TV. Mm. Colored one. Listen. Sometimes you don't have it, ne? but tell yourself that I didn't get it yet. It's on the way what? Amen. Amen. <laughs> then I tell people, we have TV. And so lucky. Ghana, at that time, if you want to watch TV, they use car battery. I said, we have TV, but we don't have the battery. Listen, the reason why David said my cup ran over, ne? it was not the cup that you said it ran over. There was a porridge like a, a pap. Hallelujah. Amen. The food was shelled. David didn't get the food. So his cup was empty. Mm. Hallelujah. Amen. So as he was standing there crying, he saw himself that the, the, the porridge has come to the cup and it's running over. Means those who don't have it, relax. Your cup uh, is about to, your blessing about to overflow in your life. I see. Oh, yes. That is what Bible said to those who don't have a child. My God. Uh, 
He said, You must sing uh, mm. a party who don't have a chart. I say, There will be a time there. Eh? You have more than those who don't have. I want to put your mind somewhere. Mm. If it's about money, now relax. Because you have seen the kingdom first and the righteousness and everything has prepared. Yet that the door has not opened yet. Amen. He's waiting for appropriate time for your life. The same. Because this time when you give the money, maybe you misuse it. But God is preparing a good time for you and your family. Say amen. Amen. Lift your eye onto the mountain. Mm. Hallelujah. Amen. Sister, don't ever say that. The doctor said, I have HIV. What am I going to do? No. We didn't born for that useless sickness. Mm. Some of the sickness, ne, it come to your life. I said, sickness is like a visitor. It come to your life. It don't stay more. Mm. No matter what, it will go back where it come from. Amen. So when doctor said you are sick, say the doctor that I'm not sick. My God. But this sickness came to visit me. I say. Tomorrow by this time, the sickness will go out. My God. By the power of Holy Ghost. Amen. I speak those who are sick right now. The same. You know, you know, listen. Me, my life, ne? I never get sickness in my life. See, amen. Amen. I'm telling the truth. Sickness. You want to say I'm going to hospital? I'm going to pray for somebody. Even I don't normally go to hospital. Say, amen. Amen. That is why I say when you go to church, ne? Check the way you are pastor. That's the same way you are. I meet one pastor. Pastor, why you say I'm going to get diabetes medicine? I said, Pastor, diabetes, oh, and I have a ulcer. I said, You are crazy. Hallelujah. Amen. So when your church member is sick, are you going to pray for your church member because two of you are sick? Is somebody get my point? We are following Papa. Don't accept that I'm sick. Tell yourself, I guess my body is not feeling fine. The fine means you know we have been working with long time. Mm. You have worked on the sun, on the on the desert, many, many places. So sometimes the body gets tired. So that means that you are sick. Mm. Don't accept it. Ghana, the food we like, ne? we eat food with chilies. I got more problem with my stomach. One doctor said, Hey, blah, you get the ulcer. I said, Me, he said, Yes. You know, every day when you entertain doctors, né, they will let you stop what you can you can eat. Don't eat fufu. I say me. Don't eat chilies. Don't drink any drink that co- contain caffeine, uh, lemon, and those things. I say, God bless you. Hallelujah. Amen. When the doctor was telling me, né, I never experienced anything in my body. Yo. I told and so lucky the toilet was asked. I said, Doctor, can you can you show me where the toilet is? So go as I pass your quick cash, I'm run away. Brother, when I go to town and I go and buy fufu mm. and I buy Fanta and I say put more chilies. Mm. What are you talking about? <laughs> Bible says, let the weak say I am strong. Hey. So I don't let a person scared of me in terms of my life. Amen. Because I know when I'm sick, the healer is Jesus Christ. Hey. When I'm down, the person who can take me up is Jesus Christ. Amen. So who are you, this woman being to say you are sick? Chili so, and I eat it and I drink the uh, 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 the Fanta, and I go to market the same that I started preaching. I wanted to experience the pain, but I didn't hear anything. Sometimes uh, you are the one who put your, yourself in trouble. You are not sick, mm. but the moment you hear that you are sick, is am I going to die? Is then look at the children, he's crying. You die fast. No person can heal you. Because automatically when the man told you, you forget the God that you are serving. Listen, my car was, this my car was giving me problem. Amen. Hallelujah. You know, I wonder sometimes, some people the prophet, my car has spoiled. Can you pray so that my car will be fine? Sister, take you to mechanic. Okay? Amen. Because the person who make a car is BMW, their company. Mm. They know where the exhaust pipe is. Mm. Where the alternator is and where the windscreen. So when you bring the car like Napoku, do it for me. I don't know what I'm going to do. Even if I put the anointing oil on it, nothing will happen. It needs a mechanic to work to fix it. Mm. So I want to put your mind somewhere. How can you let a person who never created you 
to put a certain secret that I see this kind of secret. That is nonsense. Amen. Because Jesus is the one who created me. So if my ears has blocked, mm. he know what has blocked in my ears. Say. He said there's nothing I can do. Say. I need to mention only his name. My God. By his name, the problem will go out. Jesus. So when they say you got HIV, he said, out from my life. Out. You got Elsa, mm. he said, I cast it from my life. Oh. Amen. Any problem they brought you to you, say, I don't need it in my life. Mm. But when they say money, he said, it must come. Blessings must come. The same. Favor is must come. The same. Any good thing must come to your life. Hey. Number, number. Any good things, nice things, must locate you this morning. Amen. I speak as a prophet of God. May your heart desire come to pass. Amen. When you lift your eyes onto the mountains, mm. there's no one you see apart from Jesus Christ. Sister, from now on, eh, those who believe in tradition, stop it. Amen. That in South Africa, <laughs> we have our traditional belief. I'm always challenging it. Here, there's nothing here. Those who believe in ancestors, stop this. Stop. I want to put them on. Stop it. Amen. You don't see anything here. You are just spending your money on them. Say amen. Amen. Go to Ghana. The room where nobody is there. You are not closing your eyes. When you realize, you see three old men are sitting there looking at you. Have you seen before? Say amen. amen. South Africa, I want to put your mind somewhere. All the young women are hungry too. When you talk about those who are poor in school, those who didn't pass the metric is young women in South Africa. Put your hands together for Jesus. Don't put me wrong. I know what I'm talking about. Amen. They didn't pass the metric, so there's no work. And you know how they, how they I got a dream. My sisters are calling me. When you got one, two, three, doing say it's our ancestors. Mm. And they have a certain trick. And I went to the mountains and I saw a snake. They are lying. There's no snake. They enter the sea. They don't have that power to call even snake. Say amen. Amen. Put your mind only on God. Amen. You as you are sitting here, you are not talked to a spirit before. All of you sitting here, you are not talked to a spirit before. Me, I've talked to a spirit. I'm telling the truth. Amen. I went to Ghana with Dineo and Kea. Say amen. One of my grandfather's house, they have those, those kind of spirits there. I said, Dineo, everybody is saying to Koloshi and those things, come and see his physical. I make them see his physical. Physical, I'm telling the truth, I'm not lying. Amen. His dreadlock, the dreadlock is like Kosi. Long one from top to down. Dineo and Kea, they saw, they saw that spirit live. He showed that South Africa, there's nothing good here. There's no power here. You know what? Ghana, let me tell you. If you go and beat the spiritualist, the spiritualist, if you have power, he will do it to you. Since I came here, I say I beat more than five Zangomes. Nobody has even thrown one pin on top of me. Mm. Means they are powerless. The person you have to believe is only one person. We didn't see him before, we, but we hear a lot about him. Mm. That somebody appeared in Israel, that person died on Friday, and that person rise on Sunday. Mm. Sister, check the word. Who have died and who has wake up? Mm. So me, listen. Me, when you promise me, prophet, I'll give you two and a time, and I check your shoe and your, your, your address, ne? my man will never come there. Amen. Hey, somebody get to my point? Yes, Papa. Then tell me, because you come, prophet, and I say, yes. I want to give you 100,000 tomorrow. I will say, oh, God bless you. Take your money, ne? Tell me, go take it. You know the secret. He don't have a car that costs 100,000. So how can he give me 100,000 tomorrow? Is somebody get to my point? We are following, Papa. But when somebody says, I will give you this, check the person's background, what he has done. Jesus said, I will take you where I am. Check where he was. Mm. And check some of the leaders who said they have power. Check where they died, they went. There's no good leader, a good leader is Jesus Christ. Amen. When he say, I'll give you millions, know that he's sitting on top of gold. When he say, I'll make you, I'll give you a children, know that the children is in his hand. When you know that I'll open a door for you, the mm. door is in his hand. Amen. 
I want to tell you something. Lift your eyes onto the mountain. Amen. I say, check the one in the middle. That is Jesus Christ. Mm. Don't believe anything in this world. Me, I don't trust anything. Say amen. Amen. The reason why I hate them Gomez, I don't like them. Tell, tell me when I come to them, when I come to them, because of what I've been seeing in Ghana, I want to stand there like this. Then something lifts me up. Then I can believe you. Mm. But if you don't do that and you come and do any nonsense, I got my B and then I was in Rasime B I B P I pick and pay. A certain young guy, one one lady is follow. He put more beasts in the hands here. He put powder. He stopped by my car. Then he's like, hey, hey, hey. what? Hey, hey. You are going to die. Say amen. Listen, me now. If you take your spiritual things, don't break it on me. Mm. Because before you talk, God has already told me what you want to say. I know more than you telling me. I'm telling you. Amen. I don't know what makes the person. I think God is the one. God, God is the one who tell the Sangomada, stand here, let them be too small before you go. <laughs> he look at me. Then the first day I got my BMW. He make him, him, him. Then they look at the face. I look at the guy, I think he's sick, or he has seen an apoku. I mean, eh. Then he told the guy that he's working in mining, he's going to gather this. Me, I never go to underground, even I don't know where the plant is. Hallelujah. Then the woman, the woman came. The woman started speaking to one. I said, No, speaking, he said, This one, he just got assisted power. Uh, they said, He said, You are going to die because uh, you are working in mining. The moment I came out from the car and I hold the guy, I beat the guy. And I, Police are the one who came and rescued the guy. Share, yeah. sister, let me tell you something. Don't believe in a word of the word from a man. Amen. When God says you are going to die, there's a solution. Hey. When he says you are going to get sickness, accident, there must be a solution that can avoid the accident. Mm. Don't come and tell me I'm going to die, then you leave me there. Oh, I beat him. And one, one guy too is in Shandela. I'm always saying he, he collect one woman, old woman money, fifty thousand. Mm. The, the son said the son has win lotto or he got pension fund. Mm. Said the man, woman must win it for work. You know what? See, there's no power. That's why I say God, uh, God Jesus can live his power. Mm. That's why I say touch not my anointed. When I talk about anointed, you are the anointed. God, you are the eye of God. Amen. Me too. I'm the eye of God. I'm the anointed. Mm. So what he's saying, he's not saying to anybody, he's talking about those who think they can touch you. He's talking about demons, witchcraft, that touch not my anointed mm. and do no harm. So when you said you are going to die, that means you are putting harm in my life. I need to beat you. Amen. When I went there, give my money. This is my mother. Then he sit down, he make the leg like making my money, 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 money. one slap. Bring the money and do the stuff that your nonsense. He's not done that. Why he put the money? He has had another 10,000. So when he bring the money, it's 60,000. Mm. I give the woman 50,000 and I give the woman 3,000 and I take 7,000. I say, Mama, let me go and drop you in your house. When I drop, I say, Don't go there again. They will beat you and collect your money. I want to eat my 7,000. Amen. Yeah, listen, from now on, we have those people, né? they're scared of things. Somebody has taken my picture. One of the ladies, he's working with me. The mother is angry. He said, oh, kill me. Tell the person, we must try. Your father is Nanapoku, okay? Amen. AKA. Tell the person that I'm ready. Try me and let's see. Amen. You know, when you have somebody who's at the back of you, don't scared. Amen. Amen. Me, when I was young, when you beat me, and my, I see my brother is going to fight for me. Because you have beat me, I'm the one who is leading the path. When I can say, it's not, it's not you, you're here. Brother, he's here. I would have one who is going to start beating you because my brother is standing at my back. We are some people, when I'm beating them, they come through the blow. Why? Because there's God standing at your back. He gave you authority mm. that you must stand on them. You must, you must hit them. Nothing will happen to you. The same. When he gives you authority, sister, authority is like a power. Hallelujah. Amen. Authority. 
It's like what? It's like a power. When you give a thought to do something, sister, you do it, you don't see anywhere. Amen. Amen. And somebody got my point. We are following Papa. I want to tell you something, children, children of God. There's authority you have, but you don't know that you are carrying authority. Mm. Hallelujah. Amen. The power of God is on your tongue. Say amen. Amen. When you speak, the word is like a fire. Mm. A child of God, from now on, begin to speak. It's going to work in your life. I receive in it. the name of Jesus. Amen. From now, begin to speak the word. Amen. Speak the word. I say something will happen. Mm. That those people, when they get problem, they want to see in another poku. Listen to me. All of us, we come here to learn. Amen. That's why when you are praying, me too, I pray. It's not me who saw the problem, but Jesus the who sought it. Mm. Listen to me and listen to me again. From now, when you go to church, put it in your mind, I'm going to pray and take over what belongs to me. Amen. I'm going to pray mm. so that God will sort my problem. Because sometimes, God needs your prayers more than Anapuku. He said, you know what you're expecting. But if you don't ask him, it will be hardly for you to make it. Those who can see your life, things are not working. We just finished program last week. God is still preparing something better for you. I receive it, Papa. Be on your feet. Be on your feet. Oh, be lifted. Lift up your hands. Above all the gods. Lift up your hands, cross your eyes. We lay our crowns and worship you. Oh, glorious God, we praise your name. Lift up your hands. Let me see your hands. Just lift it. Wherever you stand in there, just give thanks to, to God right now. Open your mouth, give thanks to God. Open your mouth. Open your mouth.
Just sing it, sing it. We lay our cross and worship you. Oh, glorious God. Oh, glorious God. Oh, be my friend, sing it. We praise your name. We lay our cross and worship you. Destiny around. God speak in my life. Open your mouth and speak to God right now. Open your mouth and speak. Amakalika Santa la Casoto de Bra, Rabare Saint Livito, Lebro Santa la Batorita, Jatta la Tolebrico Zalabato, Rabara Zolibaba Sete, Zalimanto le Santa la Talebica so, Brava Rabara Sotelitato, Jelebraca Saint Leto, Jetta Santa Vita Zalibato. Father, please take me to another dimension. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Make a sort of pentelectually brato, Jalacari Santa Televeto, Rabracabasa Tolebato, Opiabasa Brick, a month of the name of Jesus, a month of the name of Jesus. This is the last prayers. It's not about devil must die or Satan must die. I want you to tell God that God, I've left my eye unto you. Let my hope and my blessing come from you right now. Open your mouth and pray. Just speak to God. Like, it's only you that I left my eyes. Open your mouth and pray. Open your mouth and pray. Jetta, 
Mika Santa Vika Zone Brika Araba Zata Lata Talato Shatel Mika Santa Lavato Ebrek Santa Lavica Santa Lavato Ebrek Santa Lavato Ebrek Santa Lavato Santa Lavato Santa Lavato Santa Lavato Santa Lavato Santa Lavato Ema kansa le tole shoto le ba Arabe reke so le ba to le ba Shele bika sa to le ba Manta la pata lo to sho Brika sa le bika sa to le ba Ale ba 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 sa ta le ka so Shele bika sa la ba to Le bra ba ba la to Sa ta la bika sa la to Araba se le ke sha to lo to E se le ba to le ba Sit down have done. Amen. Put your hands together for Jesus. Oh, yes. I'm about to close. Say amen. Amen. You know, church is not like taking time. It's simple. You have done. Say amen. Sit down. Let me see your hands. Say amen. Amen. Me, my church is a, is a, is a process. Lindy, I'm lying. From, prison, uh, from preaching to prayers. From prayers to prophecy. Then we'll close. I'm going to prophesy you, either you like it or not. Amen. Listen, if, if you just need a pr prophecy, let me see your hand that you need it. Okay, listen, listen. This is a, this is a direction. Three. I need about 10 people. You are going to greet 10 people if only you need a prophecy. Mm. When you greet the person, receive your miracle, receive your miracle. Receive. You are using two seconds. Ke -ke -te greet 10 people, then we finish. I'm counting three. If you don't finish now, you won't get your blessing. One, two. Two and a half. I'm not going to walk the enemy. I'm not going to cry no gonna stand and believe hey! and receive my victory. Ah, I'm not gonna worry anymore. I'm man. not gonna cry no more. I'm just gonna stand and believe hey, and receive my hey. victory. Hey, hey. Yeah, hey, hey. I lift up my eyes out to the hills. Let me see us. Dancing, eh? Then I'll prophesy you. I'm a prophet, okay? Hey! My eyes has already switched. Say! Let me see your hand do like this. I say, I say, I say, I say, I know he'll do it for me. 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 I am in the mood. I am. 
to get up for Jesus. This lady, she looked like a certain lady I beat on Sunday. Say amen. Amen. Put your hands together for Jesus. Oh, yes. Say amen. Amen. Sunday, a week today, I beat somebody in the church. Oh, yes. Say amen. Amen. Don't be surprised. Don't let it tense you. Even I wanted to address the news. Certain time I saw the lady. Sister, sit down. I'm coming. I want people to understand me and not people say amen. Let us sit here. I'm coming. I'm coming to prophesy now. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Listen, there was a lady there. In my life, I've seen it many times, but I never see this in my world. Say amen. Amen. There's a lady who, who was coming to Rasmus Church. Everybody listen to me. You know, sometimes when some people hear something, oh, prophet has slept with someone, then people started talking. If the people don't know, then they started talking about it. Say amen. Amen. If prophets sleep with somebody, it's a news. I get it. But if somebody trying to rape a prophet, is it a ruse? Uh, nobody. shout on the lady and the lady went so i was angry i get back and i move my car say amen. amen so another day we cross church the same time and i was sending my car what i saw the lady came and opened the door sit inside and i chased her out amen. so i asked the lady that I, I told myself that this thing is not sitting so i need to report to the elders where is the table Say amen. Sister, this word, when you hear any pastor got a problem, don't start conclusion. Mm. Listen to me. When you hear any person talking about prophet, if that the person is with me or not, make investigation. Know the truth before you talk about it. Amen. See, when I called the lady, the lady when I table called the lady in the office. Listen what the lady said. The lady said, you know me for three years. Listen, we have been dating for how many years? Three years. Three years. And I told her not to tell anybody. It's a secret. She must keep the number and while we sleep, he must not tell anyone.
one. I'm coming to Namibia. I think you have seen it, the advert. Yes. I'm coming there. Maybe uh, your wishes is to meet Nana Poku 101. But let me tell you, it's not easy for you to get me now. But if you want to get me, please follow this instruction. I'm coming to where? Faith of Miracle Gospel Church. Faith of Miracle Gospel Church. God bless you. Beloved, maybe you want to see me 101. There's a number on the screen. Pick that number and ask for information because I will start the church from 31st. First is Friday, second and third. Beloved, all of them is every evening. Every evening. The church is the church is every evening from 5 o'clock to 11 o'clock. Prepare yourself and come and meet Nanapuku and your life will never be the same. I say it's what? One on one. You can see me one on one. I start every morning from 6 o'clock to 12 o'clock. 6 to 12. Come and meet Prophet Nanapuku. If you miss this program, you miss your miracle. If you miss this program, you miss your blessing. Meet me, Windock. Monte Cristo Road, opposite Share Filling Station. Meet me and your life will never be the same. My name is Nanapoku. I'm coming with Short Mind Omega. God bless you. We shall meet. Bye bye. God bless you. This is Prophet Nanapoku, beloved one. I'm coming to Namibia. I think you have seen it, the advert. Yes. I'm coming there. Maybe uh, your wishes is to meet Nanapoku 101. But let me tell you, it's not easy for you to get me now. But if you want to get me, please follow this instruction. I'm coming to where? Faith of Miracle Gospel Church. Faith of Miracle Gospel Church. God bless you. Beloved, maybe you want to see me one on one. There's a number on the screen. Pick that number and ask for information because I will start the church from 31st. First is Friday, second, and third. Beloved, all of them is every evening. Every evening. The church is the church is every evening from 5 o'clock to 11 o'clock. Prepare yourself and come and meet Nanapuku, and your life will never be the same. I say it's what? One on one, you can see me one on one. I start every morning from six o'clock to twelve o'clock. Six to twelve. Come and meet Prophet Napoku. If you miss this program, you miss your miracle. If you miss this program, you miss your blessing. Meet me, Windock, Monte Cristo Road, opposite Share Filling Station. Meet me and your life will never be the same. My name is Nanapoku. I'm coming with Short Mind Omega. God bless you. We shall meet. Bye bye. God bless you. This is Prophet Napoku. You, God bless you. My name is Prophet Nanapoku number one. If you can see, I'm coming to Namibia and I'm coming to shake Namibia very serious. Four days powerful miracle manifestation. Beloved one, uh, I'm coming there on 31st. 31st from 5 o'clock, the church has start in the, in the evening. 5 o'clock, the church has start, but on the first is Friday, it's all night. Beloved, Saturday, my God, is a service. We will start 5 o'clock the same evening. And let me tell you, Sunday is anointing service. The church will start 8 o'clock. Then I close three o'clock. Beloved, let me tell you something. When you are coming to the all night, which is fly dinner, don't forget, come with how much? Two hundred dollars of uh, Namibian currency, yes, or two hundred rands. But let me tell you something. I'll give you a certain miracle soap. You are going to bath. God is going to take every problem out. And I know this program, God is going to use me serious. So when you miss this program, you miss your blessing. Meet Nanapoku. Your life will never be the same. I love you too much. We shall meet there. Bye bye. God bless you. God bless you.
my wife. Amen. Play for me. Sit down. Lady. Hello. Go and stand there. Put your hands together for Jesus. Oh, yes. Amen. 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 Brother, how are you? You are good. I call you. Do I call you, brother? I, do I call you? I point you to come. No. Yes. When you are sitting, I told you to come. Yes. Are you sure? Yes. I, how, how did I do it? I made this or I made. How do I call you? 
Papa, sit down. Papa, sit down. You point me then. I point you. Yeah. Okay. Say amen. 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 Can I prophesy? Prophesy. Who, who, who wants prophecy urgent? You want your problem to sort urgent? You don't lift your hands. Hmm? Or you are not here for prophecy. You know, some people, when you say lift your hands, they don't lift their hands. They're scared of your secret. Stand up, I will reveal something. Mamuri don't want a sorrow. Mamuri and Zina Kuchka. Nama Papiro and you. I swear. I can't get it. Let me see your hands. Mamuri don't want a sorrow. Mamuri and Zina Kuchka. Together for Jesus. Oh, yes. Is that today I call men more than women? Eh? Amen. Hallelujah. Mm. Brother, where are you from? What's okay? KZN. KZN. Yes. Sister, and you? Sister, where are you from? Where? Lesotho. Lesotho. And you, Mama? Heidelberg. Heidelberg. Where is that place? Her bag going to Calfries. And you? I'm from Whitbank. Huh? Whitbank. Hedelbeck, Windbank, Rebeck, Woodbeck. Say Amen. Whitbank, Pumala. Pumalanga. And you? I'm also from Pumalanga. Pumalanga. You came together or everybody came to his, from his way? Uh, no. Ah, okay. I, know it's, I came from Cape Town. Cape Town? Yeah. Ah, okay. You came from where? Pumalanga. With bank. Yes. And you? Um, Kwaha. Kwaha. Some of the names look like Chinese name. Kwaha. Sunshine. To her. It's Kwaha. <laughs> Can I prophesy? Prophesy. My name is Nanapoku, number one. No doubt. When we speak, God have a work to do. Oh, yes. Me, listen. Me, I've been professor for me. I've been professor a long time. Oh, it's yeah. not today somebody can spot my name. Mm. Me, I'm allergic to prophecy. Say. Prophecy is in my stomach. Mm. Mm. It's in my eyes. Oh, mm. yeah. Listen, me now I sleep now. You just make your hand slap me, poor. I say I'll prophesy, I'm telling you. Oh yeah. Lion of Judah. Hey. We worship the Buya Little La Judah. Amen. Amen. Ah. When you talk about South Africa, I'm always saying it. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. South Africa, yeah. I say when you talk about the prophet, I don't get my size in this town. Oh, is it? Yes. No, no, no. This country, I don't have a size. No, say. I'm number one prophet. No doubt. No doubt. Mama, who call you? My friend. Yeah. <laughs> Who call you to come and stand here? Say, my friend. Ba ubizo ba nuzo ba umela. Kama ubiri tse horto imamu. Prophet. What language you speak? Ubuel. Ubolo mi sizul. Oh, sizul ba. Oh, sizul. Can I prophesy? Prophesy. People like prophesy, ne? Hmm. When I come out. Really. You like prophesy too much. Wow. This lady was sleeping eh? when I started the prophet. Stop trying, stop trying. <laughs> Can I prophesy? Prophesy. Can I prophesy? Prophesy. <laughs> oh, yes. Ah, so a man named, a man, you know, when I came to South Africa, you know, 
What I'm here uh, to be saying is a woman named Agere. Yeah. Mm. They can put it on the man. They can give that name to a man. Mm. Ntabisein. One, two, three. Whose name is Ntabisein? Uba no Ntabisein, the part way. One, two, three. No, I'm talking about the men. Nina Uba. Uba no Ntabisein. I'm coming. Put this and not you. Put your hands down. One, two, three. Whose name is Ntabisein? Uba no Ntabisein, part way. No one. Okay. What's your name? Steve. Steve. Mm. Your name is not Tabizine. Eh? Yeah. Who are you staying with? I stay with my brother. Mm. You stay with your brother in the house. Yes. But you stay in the house, but every every evening you don't you don't sleep in the house. Yes. And you sleep in Tabizine house. That yes. lady, he is who to you? Tabizine, who is he? Who is she? She's my bro brother's girlfriend. Uh -huh. Don't go there. Your brother's what girlfriend. Yeah. Okay. But why do you sleep, sleep in that house? Oh yes. Yes, in our house we don't sleep. I don't know. I'm coming. God is telling me something. I want to. I want to be specific to you. Ne? <laughs> Where is that your brother? She's at, he's at work now. He's where at work. Yeah. Did he know that every midnight you go and sleep in Tabisi house? Yeah, he don't know. He don't know. Yeah. Mm. So he don't know that two brothers are dating one lady, because you are the one who who caused the problem. Because when I'm saying that, saying you wanted to hide it. Mm. Yes, prophet. Stop Stop it. You, are you are spoiling something. Oh yes. This guy is doing this trading, uh, trading business, ne? Yes, prophet. Trading, network trading, and this guy has put a lot of money inside. Mm. I see about ten thousand. You never get any, any anything. And somebody told you to come here. I will pray for you so that you can you can make in the uh, uh, network. How do you call it? network marketing? Yes, sir. That's it. Yes, I'll come back to you. Hmm? This guy has been losing. Let me tell him something. Mm. Brother, it's because of what you're doing. Yeah. Because Zondo told me something, I had to hide it. But this one, you know, when I'm talking, the prophecy is coming. Oh, so yes. sometimes I can't control my, my, my voice. Oh, because yes. It's like when I'm talking, the same time I'm seeing Sacred it. Sacred reveal. Brother, stop it. Help me, prophet. Stop it, man. Help me, prophet. Because what you're doing is not good. Even if your brother here, it won't help him. Help me, prophet. Ah, brother, you are. You know, come and see me in office, ne? Okay, prophet. The lady is pregnant for you. Did your brother marry her or is a girlfriend? He was about, about to marry next man. Uh, uh, hey, see me after church. Don't talk too much, ne? Something like this is sensitive. Yes, sir. Come and see me after church. Mm, that's why your things are not working. Hey, says mm. something like this. You know me, ne? the way I'm seeing my things, ne? maybe Bishop don't watch me every day. Oh, it's not this kind of thing. I'm not, not saying it in public. But I mean, my vision, when I'm talking, ne? the same time I'm seeing it, mm. so I cannot hide it. Mm. So I'm sorry if Bishop is watching me. I said the anointing of God is like a pipe, oh, which, yes. has, which has burst. You cannot control it. That Amen. is how it is. So, brother, See me after church. I want to talk to you serious, ne? Hey, mm. it's abomination. Kaish. Say amen. 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 Put your hands together for Jesus. <laughs> yeah, your friend said, I have shock about this guy's prophecy. Too much purpose. Mm. Brother, how are you? You are three guys, ne? You are three guys. Never charge. There's a business these guys are doing. You call it business and yens are never charge. They bring him money. If I give mad. Say amen. Amen. And one guy has stole the money. And he ran away. So this guy has got somebody who hits people with a gun. To kill that guy. Say amen. Tell him he must stop those guys. I'm going to fix the problem for him. How much the guy took to run away? How much? Almost more, 45,000. 45,000 is too small. Yeah. This is why I want to kill somebody for that. Huh? Do you have a phone here? I don't you don't have a phone. I don't have if the money comes back to your accounts, how much will you give me? 45,000. I want the money to come now. You must not kill the person. I'll let the money come right now. Then you give mine. 
One lady give me the money during the program. Yeah. I command the money to come inside. He give money and one guy too. Often said you show the guy Sunday. Another guy came to me. I collect coins. Yes, Papa. From the guy. The guy, the guy brought me money. You saw it. Yes, Papa. God bless you. Amen. Tell this guy he must not kill the guy. <laughs> I want to open the door for him. <laughs> 45,000 yeah. is not money. It's a small money. <laughs> so I want to bring the money back to his account. <laughs> so how much you will give me? <laughs> Tell him I, I like 5,000. If you give me 5,000, 45,000 will come within 10 minutes. <laughs> yeah, I can give it to you. You can give it to me now. Okay. Yeah. Yes. 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 Tell this guy I'm giving him just 10 minutes. Even if the money comes, you don't have a phone. How can he see it? You have a phone. Ah, okay, fine. Brother, sit down 10 minutes. Ne? You get the message that the money has come. Ah, not now. Stop watching the phone. Not now. Eh? Can I prophesy? Prophesy. Tell, tell this brother that the money will come within 10 minutes. When the money comes, he must come and tell me. My and give me 5,000. I'm done. Hold my hands. During the prophecy. The brother, did he, did he know prophecy? What I told him is not about prophecy, it's about what, what makes him come here. Do you want prophet? the prophecy? Yeah, prophet. Yes, uh, he's very slow. Let him sit down. Let me go to another person. Amen. Sit down. I'm Sa done. Sa I'm done. One, two, three, four. This guy, he don't want the prophecy. Mm. Say amen. 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 Because this brother is scared that his secret will come out. Mm. <laughs> These days, I'm not going to reveal secret. <laughs> so tell him he must be okay. He must be patient. He back in your back. Say amen. You are fine. <laughs> Say amen. 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 Tell this brother now. He was somewhere in was in a certain work. I see the work clothes in his room now. This guy was working as a police. There were about four guys. Something happened. Him alone was not around. But they fired all the four. So now he took the case to court. And he wants to win the case. Am I lying? Really, really. I can't say anything. Because I'm feeling. I'm feeling so shamed. I'm feeling so shamed. It's true, Is man. that true, man of God? It's true, ne? True. Because I see police clothes in the room right oh, now. Oh, yes, father. Tell this brother, ne? Put it. The investigation has done. He yeah. must go and withdraw the case from the court. Oh, yeah. Because yeah. I know yeah. I've finished the case here. Oh, yeah. He yeah. must go to where he was working. Oh, yeah. They yeah. will take him straight. Yeah. Because yeah. the yeah. evidence says yeah. he's innocent. Yeah. Yeah. Go, yeah. Go, yeah. go and sit down. Mighty yeah. yeah. Jesus. Yeah. Mighty Jesus, one word from you can change my destiny. Oh. One word from you can change my destiny. Oh. Baba, speak. Oh. oh, yes. Secret revealer. This time I'm, I'm, I'm going it normal. Can man even man? Say amen. amen. Sister, Sister, how are you? Unjan. Sister, are you okay? Go right, sis. You are not active. Go and sit down. Because he, Baba. She's not active. Yeah. Let her go. Because many people yeah. need a prophecy here. Udu Baba, I got your call on. You shall have hands in. Wow, he's sharp. He's sharp. Oh, sharp. All right, ma'am. I'm talking a little so I look at the sharp. You say what? I'm just afraid. Ah, you are afraid? Mm. Ah, okay. Din say, Baba. You are afraid to stand in front of people or you are afraid I'm going to review things? Can I make it sharp? I don't feel right, brother. She said what? I don't feel right. Mm. Okay, look at me. Let me talk to you. She's scared. Touch my hands. Don't be scared, ne? Listen, listen. Mame. Listen what I'm telling you. Mame. 
Look at me. The reason why you came here. You meet a guy. And the guy promised to marry you. They bought a ring. They bought everything. But the ring that they bought for her. It has missing small. She mustn't scared. I see where the ring is. I want to show her, then she go and take it. That is all. You don't have to. They bought, they bought the ring expensive. Say amen. amen. So since they bought it expensive, the ring has lost. It left the box of the ring. Because I see the ring was in a certain red box. And something like a pillow is inside. And they put that ring inside. There's a diamonds on top. It has not lost. The, the, sister, don't cry. The ring is in your house now. She misplaced it. Say amen. 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 She misplaced the ring. However, however, she didn't tell the guy. However, Somebody told her that he must come here. I will bring the, the ring physical. Tell her the ring here. is in her house. <laughs> See, the bed where they are sleeping on is a big bed. <laughs> big bed. There's a something there. There's a small table behind the bed here and here. The ring was on top. You have a small boy, he's about five years. His name is Philemon. He was playing with the ring. And he fell between the bed and the wood, that side. If you put your hand by the bed and the wood like this, you find the ring there. It has not lost Go and take it. Don't be scared. I'm done. Can I prophesy? Prophesy! prophesy. Can I prophesy? Prophesy. Akibati. Akibati. Mankapama. Akibati. 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 So when you say Akibati, what do you say behind? Akibati, what? Ah, okay. Yeah. Me when I say Akibati, I say, once I'm my mama. Can I prophesy? Professor. Sister, I will see. What do you want me to tell you? Tell me. What the prophet will tell me. My name is Anapoku number one. No doubt. I will tell you. What do you want me to tell you? Where do you want me to start the prophecy from? Asim Lekai. Your side, your mother's side, your father's side, your boyfriend's side, your, side, your children's side, or your, your room side. Asim Lekai. Any side, Pastor. Any side. Any, any side of corner. Yes. Your blessing is around the corner. Mm. Hallelujah. Amen. When a pastor says your blessing is around the corner, I say, Pastor, which corner? Which corner, Pastor? Which yeah. corner? Amen. See, um, Amen. Amen. I'm in the mood, but it's like I'm taking things slow. That's how my prophet is. Sometimes I chat, sometimes I take it normal. Say amen. 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 Sister, how are you? I was you, you are mother of two children, eh? Yes, Pastor. God I must pray for you very serious. The reason why you came here in the realm of the spirit, mm. something is happening in your body which you don't like it. Amen. Sister, can I talk to you? Yes, Pastor. One, spiritually, anytime when you wake up in the morning, you vomit, you don't understand, and you are not pregnant. Amen. <laughs> Can I talk to you? Your firstborn is a girl. She's 17 years. She's very nice, the slim girl. Do you know she's pregnant, or you don't know? She's pregnant with a teacher. Pregnant. The teacher name is Molefe. Power. Say amen. amen. Don't go and beat her, ne? Don't cry. The loser every morning. You are, don't you say that your daughter is always going to your mother? So even now she's with your mother. She's scared to tell everyone. Mm. The teacher has pregnant her. The teacher name is Molefe. Say amen. Don't cry. This lady has been risk her life for the daughter for her school. But the daughter is disappointing you by teacher. 
Me from that teacher, the way I will go and beat the teacher now. Oh, yes, Lord. Don't cry, don't cry, don't cry. Give another handkerchief to her. This is not a cry. Mama, I'm coming. I'm coming to tell you many things. Mm. Oh. Say amen. Amen. Can I prophesy? Prophesy. I want to tell this woman some secret. The reason why she starts crying. Say amen. Amen. Sister, can I review everything? Yes, Pastor. Thank you. Hallelujah. Amen. Sister, it's okay. I don't want to talk too much. Because I, it's like you and the teacher, and there's a connection that was taking place. Because he used to come and visit you. Yes, that is Pastor. why he got through to talk to your daughter more. It's like, mm, mm. you are interested in the teacher, and the teacher too is interested in your daughter. Yes, uh, So now, your daughter is pregnant one month for you. Oh, Jesus. So go and see the teacher and solve the problem. Yes, but don't make your daughter, your daughter make abortion. If you try abortion, she will die. I visit how your sister pass away, Charity. Mm -hmm. She make abortion and she pass away. So oh. that your daughter, don't, don't let her do that. Oh. Don't cry, don't cry. Huh? I'm talking about your sister, you crying. The sister make abortion when the pregnancy was about six months. So the sister pass away. So now the daughter too is planning the same thing to do. The reason why I'm telling the lady, mm. I sister, don't cry. Hmm? She's can the head one, the head want to go down. Say amen. She mustn't cry. I will help her. She must not do abortion for the child. Because when she do abortion, the child will die. She must let the child deliver. Amen. Sister, stop crying. Let me talk to you. Oh. One thing is, she was interested in the teacher. And the teacher has made overtaking for her. Oh, yes, man. Say amen. Tell the lady she mustn't cry. Say amen. Amen. I want to help you. Mm. The, child, the child is innocent. <laughs> you must not go and beat her. But the teacher is the problem. Mm. Sister, let me advise you. Don't touch the pregnancy. When you ask the child, she will tell you straight that she's pregnant one month, one week, and done. But one thing is, don't terminate the child. Yes, minister. For, for the sake of your child's health, for her to live. But the moment you take her, they make abortion. The same time, the lady will die. So don't try. Ne? Yes, but you let me tell you something. Don't pray for a man for now. No man loves you, and you don't love any man. The secret is here. There's money you're expecting. It's accident fund from your side. Because you got accident about three years back. Yes. You have been expecting the money long time. Oh, yes. that, the money is coming. It's a lot of money, but it's not a lot. I see about 1.1 to 1.2 million. You, uh, Thank yeah. you. She stopped crying and she's laughing. <laughs> oh, God. Lord, you have done so much for me. I cannot tell it all. Oh, Should even if I had a thousand tongues to sing, it still would not be enough for me. Yeah. The power of money. This is why everybody needs money. Mm. Obviously, he's thinking about a daughter. When you hear 1.2, hey, yes, look at What shall I rend? Let me see your hand. And to Jehovah. For he has done so very much. Let me for see. Me. Web it. What shall I rend? Sister, mm. I wish I tell the money issue first. Then I told the daughter one last. Yes, Pastor. <laughs> Sister, don't touch the baby because money is coming. Okay, Pastor. You get some take off the child. Thank you, man. Of don't hit the lady. Talk to the teacher nice. Maybe he will collect the child as a father, ne? So do that. But the money is coming. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, man of God. Thank Amen. you. Sister, Thank when the money comes, now remember me. Okay. I will, because Pastor. Because I'm giving you just three weeks. Three weeks. Yes. You see the money. Go and sit down. Power. Sit down. Brother, how are you? Have Kun I talked to you? Kunjan, but I'm fine, Pastor. God bless you. Thank you. Where are you from? Ah, you I'm said from it already. Bank, it's yeah. okay. 
What do you want me to tell you? Do you believe in prophet? Yes, now I believe, sir. Now you believe. But yeah. first, you didn't believe. Yes. Oh, yes. Say amen. 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 The guy said, now, he believes. That means first, he didn't believe. Mm. Say amen. Amen. Okay, that means, uh, uh, brother, ask him, uh, uh, ask him what make him believe for now. I saw everything what happened here. What happened here? Ne? Yes. So you never see prophecy before, ne? I used to, but I never believe on it. Ah, okay. <laughs> Do you know I'm in your room right now? Sorry? I'm in your room. Your room. What's the room in Lako? Where you are sleeping? Now Lako. Okay. Mm, I'm standing there. Umiko. Don't you see I'm there or you don't know? I'm born to con. Yeah, con. Your room, ne? Is it's three bedroom ne? but another room that is there too small like a storeroom but they sleep inside mm -hmm. correct you sir thank you i see a certain television is broken the big one is panasonic it's not working the one that is working is on the wall it's lg it's true sir it's 24 24 inches or what say amen amen you know what there was a rain that came before this winter ne? I see the tender strike and I see it has give a line in front of the TV. I'm in your house. What? Wow. Number, number. Number, number. This is your house number. Your house number is 408. Am I lying? 408. True, Thank you, brother. You know, pa. I'm seeing something. I need to work on this, brother. Mm. Brother, can I talk to you? Yes. The house you are saying, did you buy it or somebody die and give it to you? No, my auntie died. And, and they auntie. give it to you, yes. There's money inside that you don't know. Where There's money he, he left inside. Money right now. Oh, yes. Now you make it in the name of Jesus. RC. Any money you are expecting in your accounts. Oh, Jesus. May that money go to your accounts right now. RC. Those who need miracle money must get it in the name of Jesus. RC. Put your hand together for Jesus. Blah. There's money in the house. Direct to me, Papa. Okay. It's not a lot. I see a small safe. Amen. You don't know where it is. How long do you stay in that house? It's two years now. Two years now, ne? Okay. Yes, sir. Let me tell this brother. He must go, he must break the ceiling, ne? Go to the where the gizzard is, ne? There's a small safe. The key is there. The key is in front. Open the safe. If you don't get one, you get about 60,000. Because that aunt who died and give you the place, he was accountant at the work. So the work money is the top there, Thank waiting. You, so go and bring it. Which side of my room? Oh, I said behind. <laughs> I am the Holy Ghost the naked boy. Hey! I am the Holy Ghost the naked boy. If, if you touch me, me, I will show you. I'm, I'm the Holy Ghost the naked boy. See, I want to show the brother. Me, I've seen everything. Mm. I said he must go to the top of the ceiling. Eh? They put this at the one that makes the water become hot. Yes. Behind, behind, there's a small safe there. Oh, I must go to the house with you. I can go and bring the money. Then we share it before. I get it, Papa. I understand it now, Papa. See, I mean, yeah. she must go there. The safe is there. Yeah. And you know, the safe is long time there. It's a lot of dust. And the key is on top of the safe. So I'm you just there, open. Papa. Uh -huh. 
you open the money inside in is on the uh, bundle bundle ne? okay bundle. i'm it's going not there now yeah, I'm, I'm coming I, I know you are going to see <laughs> i like i like this guy's spirit <laughs> see amen so i said maybe i'll be lying when you go there i said i see the money from 20 to 30 40 or i won't go 60. so when i say god said you're lying say amen amen let 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 let, 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 let him go now you'll find about from twenty thousand to let's say forty thousand i will come and share with you papa god bless you thank you, oh, you yes. know all what i'm saying i wanted to hear this part that i will come and share with you Oh, as, yeah. I, as I hear that, mm. I'm fine. Tell this brother, ne, God has made a way for him. Amen. Thank you, Papa. Because the wife has, was admitting hospital. And this guy was thinking how you get money to go and pay some debts. But the debt there is not too much. It's about 3.5. So this guy was stressing too much. So how am I going to get the money? But the hope is the money is in the house, but he didn't oh, yeah. see. That's why I say I'm a prophet. When I prophesy at the same time, the prophecy is working. Oh, yes. Ah. So he must go there. That's true, Papa. He must go there and take it. Mm. Any how much you give me. Even if you are not coming here, check my television. There's an account number. Put it inside. My number is there. Call me. I will talk to you. I will God bless you. you Sit down. Pastor. Thank you very much. Why are you looking at my face like that? Are you scared of me? Oh, you are not scared? Yes. You are fine? Yes. Are you looking for a certain man? Yes. Your husband has lost you. are looking for him? Yes. Ah, okay, I will show you. Oh, yes. Oh. Something like this. When I say, people say I'm not good pastor. Your husband, eh, your area, he is there. And he's always talking to you that he's in trip. Mm. He's alone. I will, I will show you the house, ne? Then you go and knock. Then you bring your husband out. Ne? Mm. Number, number. Some people ask me, say, when What do you make me fine? I, I just said, and I'm saying, say, My Jesus will make me the fire. It's not what I'm saying. This woman eh, is not the prophecy you listen. I'm telling you something I know before I prophesy you. Because this one's a news brief. Like your husband has gone. He told you he come five days time. Now it's one week. But he still not come. Okay, let me show you something. Man. We know Refile. I know you know more Refile. Eh? But let me show you the Refile I'm talking about. Where you are staying, there's a, a king. A king. He's a king, eh? Yes. He's staying there behind. And his house is white, but they put South African flag on top of that house. Have you seen that house? Yes. Mm. You know, there's a lady there. The name is Rufile. She's a hairdresser. Yes. Uh -huh. Even used to do the hair there, but small misunderstand that you left. The lady is a very nice lady. Yes. She don't stay in that king house, eh? She stay in other opposite. That house number is house number 113. Yes. Uh -huh. yes prophet. When you go there, check the first room. Knock. You say you are looking for Mr. Mudisi, your husband. He will come out. Number, number. Some people ask me, say, Ay, ay, ay. I think they make me fine. I guess they tell them, say, When Jesus will make me the fine. Amen. God said he's going to lift you serious. Because, Mama, listen to me. You have been working for a certain guy, ne? like you have been washing the clothes, you clean the houses. Mm. People call you to do those kind of work. Ne? But let me tell you something. God has started the person has to, because you ask a certain amount that you want to use it to complete your house. Ne? Yes. So the person has planned to give you the money. That money, I don't need anything from it. Ne? Yes. Because that's what you have been playing about. The person promised you, but now he's like, he's telling you lies. Ne? God has seen what you are asking from God. So God says he's going to give you the money. Oh, yes. When he gives you the money, don't bring me some. Use the money. 
to finish your house. Yes. That's say yes, the Lord. Listen, you have four children, two boys, two girls. Yes. God said you must write their name, bring it to me. Let me protect them because the first one have a problem in the ears. Every time when you sit there, you see some white, something like a milk coming. Eh? Yes. When you go home, take one of my water, bring one water to him. Put it in your mouth and spray it, throw it in the ears. That problem has sought forever and ever. I'm done. Go and sit down. Thank you. Oh, power. Mama, listen. Go and, go, go and bring your husband from the room, but don't go and fight. Ne? Hmm? Where, where your husband is? When you go there today, don't go and fight. Yes. When you get there, Mr. Modise, you see you come out with a boxer shorts. You know your husband have big stomach. Me, I no go so Hey, I Me. no go for back for blood. Me, I, I no go, go suffer. suffer. I, I no go back for bread. Yes, Papa. Hey, so when Jesus. I was coming, I took the belt, and but God told me my that I must God. give him my clothes. I the receive. clothes I wear. I see receive. what I mean? Listen to me. My the God. clothes I will give you to it will make you become more powerful. My God, I receive. As you are here, it's like you are in the mountain. My God. And I prophesy you the time you go, God, I will make sure that your church will start progressing. I receive. Jesus. Because this guy came from France, ne? Say Thank amen. you, Lord Jesus. He has spent about more than two weeks here or Thank one week. You Lord. Thank you, Lord. I'm praying for him and the one lady here. Thank Say you, amen. Jesus. I'll make sure 100% that when you go, you start seeing a lot of explo explosion of your blessing. My God, I receive. Because last night I was praying for you. God said, My God. I must tell you, it's like you came to mountains to wait. Hallelujah. So this is your time. I Brother, receive. Since your life, I'm telling you, look at me. Yes, Papa. When you go, things won't be okay the way you are expecting it. I man. receive. But when you go, things will be spoiled. Things, many problems will come. I receive. But give yourself one month and stand in the problem. Yes. After one month, you see what will start happening. I receive. That's it, the Lord. I'm done. Sit down. Hallelujah. Brother, stand up. Where are you from? This guy, I want to help him, but somebody wants to give me a big case. Oh, no, sis, and that, that case will be in court case, but God must break it and sort it for him. I'm from Bushburg region. Bumada. Something good is about to happen for him. Oh, yes, I receive. But I receive. I receive. Who want to turn it yes. for him? But I want to break it. Oh, yeah. That is brother. Ne? Are you working, sir? Yes, sir. Yes, yes uh, I have a business. Your business man, let me tell you something. It. I'm coming. There's more opportunities ne, that you have lost, especially money. Yes, man. You have a lot of opportunity of money, but let me tell you something, brother. Yes. Let me put your man somewhere. Ne? You, the way God created you, God didn't Ooh. create you like you must work for somebody. Listen y to me. Yes, yes. So if you are working for somebody, you must stop it from now because God wants people to work under you. Yes. Uh, brother, as you are standing there, you are a very big person, but spiritually, somebody has avoided some of the blessing from you. Yes. So I want to open that door so that it can be free. Yes. Offense, I ask this guy, if I, if I tell him to uh, sow a seed for me, how much he can sow for me so that I can bless him? Because when a prophet, before, when prophet eats, prophet prophesy. So uh, ask him for me. Offense, uh, no, I ask uh, him first. I want this guy to, you know, I want to change his destiny. And what I'm going to do for him, I'll use only coins to do the election for him. Oh, yes. I'll let this guy go. Uh, brother, do you, have a, do you have your own company yes. for tenders? Yes, I I'm do. I'm going to make you make millions. Yes, I, I know. I, I, receive, I, receive, I, receive, I receive. I receive in the name of Jesus. Madam, come, come, let me pray for you. Somebody is covering your face. Now. I am. Oh, ben, sir, ask this brother how much he can show oh. for me. I want more money so that I can, I can lift him. Let's say, what's a poor prophet? I'll give you 20. Daddy, you say 400, Papa. Uh, he's too small. Do you think I'm a small boy? 400 line. This is my last man. Okay, give it to me. 
Have you seen have you seen millions in your account before? You ever seen it? No. Okay, give it to me. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. You never see. Also, if this money is one is hundred rand, eh? yes. If hundred rand tend to become hundred thousand, yes. Within, within one month, you yes. see four hundred thousand come to your mind. Uh, we account straight. Yes. Are you going to remember me? Yes. Okay, I'm always throwing a seed on the on the chief. You. you saw a seed always, ne? Yes, on the chief. Okay. Yes. This morning, eh? Yes. I'm going to share for some people, ne? And God is going to open a big door for you. Oh, okay. I receive. I receive. I receive. I receive. Put your hand together for Jesus. I receive. Madam, come. Mr. Modise wife. Go and call go and call your husband from the room. Listen. This morning. Go and deposit it in your accounts. Yes. You see more money and it transfer to this man. Yes, prophet. Thank you. Hey. Satan, I hate your name. Sit down. Power. Lord, you are faithful. For what you have done for me. You are very, very good. I am nobody. You make somebody before. What I thank you. Thank you, Lord. Again, Nasigi. Again, Nasigi. Take it in the name of Jesus. By the power of the Holy Spirit. Whatsoever they have set against you, I've seen it and I break it. Oh, yes. Amen. Amen. Put your hand together for Jesus. Let me see your hands. Put your hand together for Jesus. I want to pray for some people. I want them to come and stand here. We have some people you can see yourself that where I am, I'm supposed to be far. But now my life is still standing on one side. If you feel that, come and stand here. I want to pray for you. You can see yourself. I'm, suppo I'm supposed to be far. Kaish. Lift up your hands. Lord, you are faithful for what you have done for me. You are very, very happy for all your kind goodness. 
I was nobody before, but God has made me somebody. All I say, I say, thank you, Lord. Lord, you are faithful for what you have done for me. I'm a very, very happy for your kindness and your goodness. I was nobody before, but God has made me somebody. What I say now, I say, thank you, Lord. We are saying thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Jehovah Nisi. Thank you, Lord. Jehovah Rapha. Thank you, Lord. I will give you your glory. Thank you, Lord. I say thank you. Namibia, I think you have seen it. The advert, yes. I'm coming there. Maybe uh, your wishes is to meet Nanapoku 101. But let me tell you, it's not easy for you to get me. Eh? But if you want to get me, please follow this instruction. I'm coming to where? Faith of Miracle Gospel Church. Faith of Miracle Gospel Church. God bless you. Beloved, maybe you want to see me 101. There's a number on the screen. Pick that number and ask for information because I will start the church from 31st. First is Friday, second and third. Beloved, all of them is every evening. Every evening, the church is, the church is every evening from 5 o'clock to 11 o'clock. Prepare yourself and come and meet Nanapuku and your life will never be the same. I say it's what? One on one. You can see me one on one. I start every morning from 6 o'clock to 12 o'clock. 6 to 12. Come and meet Prophet Nanapuku. If you miss this program, you miss your miracle. If you miss this program, you miss your blessing. Meet me, Windock. Monte Cristo Road, opposite Share Filling Station. Meet me and your life will never be the same. My name is Nanapoku. I'm coming with Short My Omega. God bless you. We shall meet. Bye bye. God bless you. This is Prophet Nanapoku. Beloved one, I'm coming to Namibia. I think you have seen it, the advert. Yes. I'm coming there. Maybe uh, your wishes is to meet Nanapoku 101. But let me tell you, it's not easy for you to get me. Eh? But if you want to get me, please follow this instruction. I'm coming to where? Faith of Miracle Gospel Church. Faith of Miracle Gospel Church. God bless you. Beloved, maybe you want to see me one-on-one. -on -one. There's a number on the screen. Pick that number and ask for information because I will start the church from 31st. First is Friday, second and third. Beloved, all of them is every evening. Every evening. The church is, the church is every evening from 5 o'clock to 11 o'clock. Prepare yourself and come and meet Nanapuku and your life will never be the same. I say it's what? One on one, you can see me one on one. I start every morning from six o'clock to twelve o'clock. Six to twelve. Come and meet Prophet Napoku. If you miss this program, you miss your miracle. If you miss this program, you miss your blessing. Meet me, Windock, Monte Cristo Road, opposite Share Filling Station. Meet me and your life will never be the same. My name is Nanapoku. I'm coming with Short My Omega. God bless you. We shall meet.
Hallelujah. God richly bless you and bless your entire life. I have a very special invitation that I am about to give it to you. I am inviting you to Kingdom Prayer Ministry each and every time on Friday service. The theme of the service is Jericho Hour. My God, God is going to work in the name of Jesus. Prophet Danapuku and Kingdom Prayer Ministry is giving you very special invitation each and every time on Friday service. It is Jericho Hour, Jericho Hour and Jericho Hour. Beloved, come, let us pray to break any evil chain, any evil wall that is restricting you from your prosperity, from your financial breakthrough. Come and your life will never be the same. That, that is Friday service. The church starts at 5 p.m. in the evening, then we close exactly 12. I know as you are coming, any altar that is fighting against you shall be broken in the name of Jesus. Any financial stagnation shall be released in the name of Jesus. Any kind of burden upon your shoulders shall be taken off in the name of Jesus. It is Jericho hour, Jericho hour, and Jericho hour. It is happening each and every time on Friday service. That is Pretoria West, Rebecca and Charlotte Street. It will never be the same in the name of Jesus and your life is going to turn around. Make it a point. Come and meet senior major prophets. Prophet Nanapoku each and every time on Friday service. That is Jericho hour. And I know the God of Kingdom Prayer Ministry will answer you in the name of Jesus. God richly bless you. It is Jericho hour, Jericho hour and Jericho hour in Pretoria West, Rebecca and Charlotte Street and your life will never be the same. God richly bless you. Bye-bye. Praise God. Hallelujah. Prophet Nanapoku number one. If you can see, I'm coming to Namibia and I'm coming to shake Namibia very serious. Four days powerful miracle manifestation. Beloved one, uh, I, I'm coming there on 31st. 31st from 5 o'clock, the church has started in the, in the evening. 5 o'clock, the church has started, but on the first is Friday, it's all night. Beloved, Saturday, my God, is a service. We will start 5 o'clock the same evening. And let me tell you, Sunday is anointing service. The church will start 8 o'clock, then I close 3 o'clock. Beloved, let me tell you something. When you are coming to the all night, which is Friday night, don't forget, come with how much? $200 of uh, Namibian currency, yes, or 200 rands. But let me tell you something. I'll give you a certain miracle soup. You are going to bath. God is going to take every problem out. And I know this program, God is going to use me serious. So when you miss this program, you miss your blessing. Meet Nanapoku. Your life will never be the same. I love you too much. We shall meet there. Bye-bye. God bless you.
authority bless you and bless your entire life. I have a very special invitation that I am about to give it to you. I am inviting you to Kingdom Prayer Ministry each and every time on Friday service. The theme of the service is Jericho Hour, my God. God is going to work in the name of Jesus. Prophet Danapuku and Kingdom Prayer Ministry is giving you very special invitation each and every time on Friday service. It is Jericho Hour, Jericho Hour and Jericho Hour. Beloved, come, let us pray to break any evil chain, any evil wall that is restricting you from your prosperity, from your financial breakthrough. Come and your life will never be the same. That, that is Friday service. The church starts at 5 p.m. in the evening, then we close exactly 12. I know as you are coming, any altar that is fighting against you shall be broken in the name of Jesus. Any financial stagnation shall be released in the name of Jesus. Any kind of burden upon your shoulders shall be taken off in the name of Jesus. It is Jericho hour, Jericho hour, and Jericho hour. It is happening each and every time on Friday service. That is Pretoria West, Rebecca and Charlotte Street. It will never be the same in the name of Jesus and your life is going to turn around. Make it a point. Come and meet senior major prophets. Prophet Nanapoku each and every time on Friday service. That is Jericho hour. And I know the God of Kingdom Prayer Ministry will answer you in the name of Jesus. God richly bless you. It is Jericho hour, Jericho hour and Jericho hour in Pretoria West, Rebecca and Charlotte Street and your life will never be the same. God richly bless you. Bye-bye. Praise God.